as always, thank you everyone for playing. I know that if it's anything like it is here at Tulsa, it's a beautiful spring day. So for you to be inside is probably a waste of a beautiful spring day, but I appreciate it. Hopefully it'll be worth it. This is our spring carnival game. And so as always, um, have stuff ready and, you know, I think all of you have played in these games before, so you kind of know what to expect. Um, so there will be, start with possible artifacts and attributes. Um, there could be a black hat, which if you are killed, your team will not be revealed. Normally I'll say like, oh, you killed Jesse. Jesse was on the village team. If you're wearing a black hat, I won't say what team you're on. Uh, carnival ticket, if you have that, that's a one-time use. At the beginning of any day, you can say you want to turn in your carnival ticket and you will go out of the village to the carnival for that day. Means you won't be able to participate in the votes or anything, but obviously you won't be able to be voted out either. So that could be good. Uh, a new uh, attribute is the curmudgeon. If you're a curmudgeon, you hate all things carnival related. So any uh, role, carnival roles that would write your name down at night will not affect you. So you can't be sent on a roller coaster. You can't go into the house of mirrors. You can't even go to the carnival tick or to the carnival. And also if there's killing roles, they will not affect you if they're carnival. Werewolves doesn't matter, village doesn't matter, only carnival roles. Hunters, you should all know. Lichens, um, if you are checked by a seer, then you will show as a werewolf. Doesn't affect other types of checks, just a seer check. Uh, pocket knife is a one-time use. If you're nominated and you have a pocket knife, you can use it to stab the player who nominated you and kill them. Uh, tinfoil hat, if a seer checks you, they'll just get like a, I don't know what they are because you're wearing a tinfoil hat. The, if you have the tough attribute, that means it would take two kills to eliminate you. You will not be told that you lost one of your lives. So all of those, if you have any of those, you will know it. The next group, you won't know if you have this attribute. Um, if you are a bum and you're killed during the day, then the day continues for an additional vote. If you're cursed when you're attacked by werewolves, you could you would turn into a werewolf. That could be a village or carnival. If you have wolvesbane, wolvesbane, wolfsbane, you cannot be killed by werewolves at night. You can be killed any other way, just cannot be killed by werewolves at night. There could be someone who is drunk. They will be told they are a plain villager after three or on day three, they will uh, receive their actual role. It will be based on whichever team has lost the most members at that point. If you're a villager, you will become the Sandman, which means once per game at the start of a night, you can wake up and immediately in the night phase, will immediately go to the day phase. If you're on the werewolf team, you'll be a plain werewolf. If you're on the carnival team, you'll get one of the random carnival roles that aren't actually in the game. Courtney, if you want to play, there is space. I'm just starting going over the rules. So, so for the village team, you win by eliminating uh, all the werewolves and having zero living carnival team members in the village. That could mean they're all dead, or it could mean they're all in the carnival, just as long as it's only villagers on the screen during the day, basically. Uh, there will be an unknown number of plain villagers. There will be a shapeshifter which in this game, there will be a shapeshifter on each team. I'll wake them up separately. Um, so I'll wake up village shapeshifter, shapeshifter wolf, and carnival shapeshifter. Basically each night, you're gonna pick a number between one and 20. Um, 17 of those have a different role and you will shift into that role and get to do that action <laughs> for that night. So for instance, I may show you seer. That means that you get to do a seer check. I may show you um, burlesque performer, you get to do the burlesque performer action. So it's just that one night you get to do that one action. It's not like you're turning to that team or anything like that. It's just one night. Three of the numbers are death. So there is a risk. 
if you pick a number that kills you, you're going to die. And also, you're all picking from the same list. So let's say that Balaj is the village shapeshifter and he picks number one, and Sonya is the carnival shapeshifter and she also picks number one. Number one has already been used, so she won't get an action that night. So the shapeshifters aren't even guaranteed to get an action if they pick a number that's already been picked. So there was a question here about the artifacts and attributes. Can there be multiple of the same? Uh, there could be, yes. Oh. There could be some of them. There could be multiples, yes. Nobody will have multiples. Like there wouldn't be someone that is tough with a pocket knife and a tinfoil hat or anything like that. Ah, yeah. At most, you would have one. So they could, there could, they could be, be two. There tinfoil could hats. be two bombs. Yeah. There could be four people with pocket knives, stuff like that, yes. Um, so from this next group, there will be some combination. I said minimum two. I don't know if we have enough where that minimum two is guaranteed, but there will be at least one of these. There could be a friendly neighbor. They wake up and select a player to receive a peanut butter and jelly sandwich because apparently today is National Peanut Butter and Jelly Sandwich Day in America because Americans have to have stupid holidays every day. So you, <laughs> you, will, you will show me a name. I will send a message to that player saying that, you know, Balaj, the friendly neighbor, gave you a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So it's basically telling a person each day that you're on the village team. Uh, the hapless victim, if either of your neighbors is attacked in the night, you should all be following my order. So, and I need to move Lucy back to her spot and Courtney to her spot. Andreas has a number now. He wants to be between Anna and Jerry. That could be very dangerous. <laughs> All right. Um, if either of those are attacked, and basically, if either of your neighbors are going to die, oh. you're going to die instead of them. You're just kind of next to them and die. Um, there could be a huntress who will wake up each night once per game. They can select a player to kill. Whoever they pick will die, regardless of what team, but that's a one time use only. There could be a Sasquatch. If the village does not vote to kill a player, you will turn into a werewolf. And that is, if the village votes to kill somebody, but the player doesn't die for some reason, you do not turn. It's only if time runs out or three nominations and the village never votes. There could be a sheepdog, which if the time runs out on a day without a vote to kill, then that player places a lone vote to kill. So they will be publicly revealed, and then they will choose who dies. Um, there could be a trapper who will set a trap around another player. If that player is trapped at night, the attacking player will be killed instead. If the werewolves attack that player, I'll show this sign, and they have to pick one of them to sacrifice in the trap. So, And then there will be... So there will be does, a bodyguard. It's not for voting? The trap? If we vote the person? No, the trap is only for night attacks. Okay. How it was originally created. Some people have made it where it's a voting thing, but that gets... I already have enough stupid, confusing things. I don't want to remember that, too. <laughs> okay, bodyguard. There's guaranteed to be a bodyguard. It'll either be a confident bodyguard, which if you protect successfully, then the following night you can either protect the same player or two different players. Could be an escalating bodyguard where the first night you get zero, then you get one, two, three, et cetera, until you get a successful protection, then you go back to zero and then it keeps going. So if you always protect successfully, you'll get one, then zero, then one, then zero, then one, then zero. And the completely overpowered bodyguard, you will learn which players are going to die and then you choose who you wanna protect. So you could get a list of one person. You could get a list of five people. You can choose not to protect any of them. You can protect yourself. It's up to you. But you will know who's going to die that night. So again, overpowered. Uh, seers check to try to find werewolves. An alliance seer, you'll show me a name of a player. You won't get any information on that player until the following night. You will show me a second player's name. I'll give you a thumbs up if they're on the same team. Thumbs down if they're not on the same team. There is an overpowered seer. 
which if you select, get a thumbs up, you get to pick another player. If you get another thumbs up, you get to pick another player. So you might find five werewolves on night zero if you're really, really lucky. Again, overpowered. And there could be a reactive seer, which you only get a check if a village team member is voted out that day. And then on the werewolf team, werewolf team wins by um, no living carnival team members in the village and parity in the village with living village players. At night zero, they'll all wake up. There will be at least one plain werewolf. There will be a shapeshifter wolf, exactly like the regular shapeshifter. You'll wake up that you're on the wolf team. Then there will be a combination of some of the following kamikaze wolf. You wake up like normal. If the seer checks you at night, you and the seer will both die. There could be a pet wolf, which a pet wolf on night zero will pick a player to be their owner. If you are killed before <laughs> your owner, your owner will also die. There could be a sacrificial wolf, which if another wolf is attacked at night, say by the huntress or by one of these other roles on the carnival, or maybe a shapeshifter gets a kill. So if a wolf is uh, supposed to die at night, you will die in their place. A uh, starving wolf, while you are alive, if there is not a vote to kill, then the werewolves will get an additional kill that night. And the wolf cub is if you're killed, then the wolves get an additional kill the following night. Um, and then there will be one of the following active wolves, which I will just say active wolf, please wake up at night. So if you're one of these five, that means you'll wake up that night. The beta wolf is a, one of my favorite wolves. Um, you can once per game after the wolves decide on who wants they want to kill, instead of killing them, you can choose to sacrifice a different wolf and turn the attack victim into a wolf instead of them dying. Uh, the carnival wolf, if you're ever sent to the carnival, then that night you get to kill one of the other people who was sent to the carnival with you. So the uh, showman needs to be careful who they send to the carnival. They could be killing people. Uh, the Godfather Wolf uh, shows as a village player. They're kind of like a wolf man for seer checks, but once per game, they get to wake up separately and kill an additional player on that night. After they kill, then the seer will actually see them as a werewolf. So you could get away for a few days as a wolf man, hope the seer checks you, then kill and uh, maybe get away with it. Mystic Wolf can wake up and learn a player's exact role. The weakling wolf does not wake up with the other wolves. So if you are the weakling wolf, you do not wake up when I call werewolves. You wake up by yourself. You pick a player to die. If it is a plain villager, they will die. If they have any sort of role, they will not die. Also, you could be killed by the werewolves because they don't know who you are. And then the carnival team, you win by having zero living werewolves in the village and reach parity with living werewolf, or sorry, living village team members in the village. The carnival team does not know who their teammates are, but you will be given um, some words and phrases that you can help identify each other. So when you are sent the role, if you're one of these carnival team members, I'll also send you the list of the words and phrases you can use to identify each other. Once again, there will be a shapeshifter, Guaranteed, same thing as the others. Showman, I'm going to roll a D4 or a D6. Whatever I roll, that's the number of people you get to send out of the village that day. And then there will be some combination. If you have a um, active role that wakes up, I will send you your stage name. That's when you will wake up. So I'm not going to wake up like 15 different carnival roles at night. I'll just wake up a couple stage names. So if I say, you know, Balage the Brilliant, and your stage name is Balage the Brilliant, you may be the Barker or the Daredevil or whatever. You'll wake up when I call that. Um, animal Trainer, you select a player. If they are a werewolf, they do not count towards the werewolf win condition as long as you are alive. 
Um, if you're the Barker, you're going to pick a player. They go to the House of Mirrors. Basically, any action they may perform or have on, performed on them will be mirrored back to the person. So for instance, if Bill is in the House of Mirrors and Liz, the bodyguard, protects Bill's, protects Bill, she will actually be protecting herself. Or if Bill is the bodyguard and tries to protect Liz, Bill is protecting himself while he's in the House of Mirrors. So it just basically reverts back to the person doing it. Burlesque performer will uh, distract a player from doing their uh, night roll. So I will show you, if you're distracted, I'll show you this so you know that you don't get to act that night. If a werewolf is distracted, then the entire team is distracted and that they won't get a kill. <clears throat> um, contortionists cannot be killed at night by any means, werewolves, huntresses, uh, anybody. Uh, Daredevil, if you survive a vote during the day, so if you're nominated and there is a vote and you are not voted down to be killed, then that night you can select a player to kill. Um, the Geek, um, which if you watched a recent Academy Award nominated uh, movie, then you know what the Geek is. Once per game, you can publicly attack a player. If it's a werewolf, you kill them. You're going to eat them. So you're going to come out. People will know you're on the uh, carnival team, but you kill a werewolf, maybe. If it's not a werewolf, they don't do anything because you don't eat people. So uh, human cannonball, when you're killed, you're either going to select left or right, and you're going to kill the three people to the left or to the right, whichever direction you choose. Um, and human resources, you can pick a role and a player if, or you will pick a role, you'll learn if that role is in the game. So you could use it to try to identify which carnival team members are on your team or which wolves, whatever. Then you also can pick a player and learn if they have that role. Um, hypnotist, everybody's favorite. Once per game, starting on night three, when a night action is called from the village team, you can wake up with them. If you wake up and they wake up, you kill them and steal their ability. But if nobody wakes up, then you will die. So that means that if you have a village role at night, you are not required to wake up. If you think the hypnotist might wake up to try to kill you, you can choose not to wake up, not to take your action, and then the hypnotist would die. But that only starts on night three. The knife thrower selects a player at night. If that player is nominated and survives a vote, then the following night, the knife thrower chooses either to kill that player or to select a different player. So maybe you realize the player you picked was is on the carnival team, so you don't want to kill them. You can then choose a different player so they won't die. The roller coaster operator, um, you select two players and any actions taken on either are swapped. So if you choose Balaj and Sonia, and Sonia is protected by the bodyguard, actually Balaj would be protected by the bodyguard. Obviously, if that's combined with a Barker and a House of Mirrors, then it's going to get really confusing, and I will probably mess things up, but hopefully I won't. Also, because of the roller coaster operator, wolves can target themselves, or wolves can kill each other at night because of swapping and things. So. If you choose another wolf and they don't get swapped or whatever, they're just going to die. So it's a risk that if the wolves want to take it, they can. It may not be the smartest thing, but it's up to them. Uh, strong man, you survive the first attempt to kill you, no matter what. And the vendor, you wake up and give a player a prize. I will show you what the prizes are, and you pick who you want to give that to. So. That is it. Breathe in. Look into these eyes. Subscribe to the channel. Now, exhale. Oh, let's hope this works. Okay. Everybody can go to sleep. It is night zero, and as, uh, let's get that ready. Okay, 
Let's start with my showman. Showman, please wake up. You can send this many people to the carnival today. Thank you. Can I have Dazzling Darla please wake up? Dazzling Darla, if you have a night action you can perform tonight, please do so. Thank you. Can Myron the mind blowing please wake up? Myron the mind blowing, if you have a night action that you can perform tonight, please do so. Thank you. Next to the stage, could the phenomenal Praveen please wake up? If you have a night action for tonight, please do so. Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? My seer, whichever type of seer you may be. Thank you. Could my trapper please wake up? Trapper, you have the option of setting a trap tonight. Remember, you only get one in the game. So with no information, you may want to wait, but you can tonight if you want. All right, thank you. Can all of my werewolves. Of course, if you're the weakling werewolf, you do not get to wake up, but all of my werewolves, that includes the shapeshifter wolf, the active wolf, all of the werewolves, please wake up. You should see this many. All right, thank you. Could my pet wolf please wake up? This is the only night you'll wake up separately. Pet wolf, who would you like to be your owner? If you die before them, then they will also die. Okay, thank you. Can my active wolf wake up? Active wolf, if you have a action you can take tonight, please do so. Thank you. Can my friendly neighbor please wake up? Who would you like to give one of those peanut butter and jelly sandwiches that everyone was talking about before the game started? You seem to be the most popular player here. All right, thank you. That should be, because shapeshifters don't wake up. I don't need a bodyguard to wake up. Huntress won't be waking up. 
I believe, let me just make sure I remembered everybody because sometimes when there's 5,000 roles that I put in a game because I'm a horrible moderator and do stupid things like that, I forget. Um, yep, 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 yep. Okay, that should be everybody. So everybody can wake up. And before the day begins, we have da, 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 da. Flick going to the carnival. And we have Anna going to the carnival. And we have, uh, we have Matthias going to the carnival. So the three of you turn off your cameras for the day, but you will return before tonight begins. And with that, we can begin. Seven minute day. Yes, I was like so lucky. To, oh, sorry, go ahead. I would like to just say something. Um, th this is very boring, but I feel like um, having this role, this is the one thing I should do. Uh, I got a Lycan attribute. I'm on the village team, but I want to tell that to whoever sees people, don't waste your time with me. Like right. if you feel like you must make a, a sacrifice uh, of me for the for the starving wolf or the Sasquatch or the sheep sheepdog person, then that's fine. Um, but like the seer just shouldn't waste their time with me unless it's an alliance seer and they want to have a the symbol for. Do you know them. that you're a lichen if you're a lichen? Yes. Yes. Uh, I will also say there is a one other type of seer. The oh yeah, the overpowered seer. Because they can keep checking, so Barbie might be a good person to start with. But no, listen, Brandon, no, I'm even, a horrible person to start with. Even if Barbie is a lichen, she could be a carnival lichen. Of course. No, well, no. What I'm saying, no, what I'm saying is right, they don't, I, they don't automatic, they don't automatically kill. They just keep getting checks until they don't, until they don't get a werewolf anymore. Yeah. Correct, Adam. Yeah. Or does it chain indefinitely? But it would just be like yes. you could verify that oh, Barbie yeah. is telling the truth that she's either a wolf yeah. or a lichen. But she yeah, already well, kind of well, confirmed that. But... I want to do that. So. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really matter. I guess it's a fine, yeah. safe thing to do. I mean, if you did check her and you got that it was not correct, that would be interesting, I guess. <laughs> that would be really yeah. weird. But is it true that we know all attributes? No. All of them? Only the top all. ones in the document. Oh, yeah. The bottom ones you do. But you can make Don't know if you're burned, oh, okay. Or spared, I see. I didn't mm. even notice those ones. But anyway, that thing. was all I wanted to say. So, Joseph, do you have the pocket knife? Maybe. Uh, <laughs> you can try out, try it out, Lucas. <laughs> ones who were sent out, are they staying out until next day? Mm -hmm. Is she a bit quiet? Oh, it's to, tonight. They come back tonight. Yeah, they come they back come, before the they night. They come back before the night. Yeah. Sorry. You can kill them, Lucy. You can kill them in the night. But it would be not very <laughs> nice. Okay, awesome. Well, you were. Awesome. <laughs> I just kill them then. Who is it? <laughs> Flick. Who else? Anna. 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 So I'm just gonna do Flick, and I'm Matthias, and then you know. Well, you get to kill three people at once. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, stop the clock that's real gonna, quick. That's gonna. That's gonna be the order. Someone had a question, and I want to answer it publicly. Um, if you have a carnival ticket, then you publicly announce that you want to use it after I send out the people. So like the sh if the showman is still in the game and sends people out, I'll say so, 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 or out. And then if you have a carnival ticket and you also want to be gone that day, you'll publicly announce that you want to use it. Okay, so, I would like to use mine, Adam. Um, all right. <laughs> um, it seems Jesus that cat. someone gave you a counterfeit ticket. So <laughs> <laughs> so this, is there like a limit on time? Like were, you can't go at the last second. Right? Did you, you see, educate yourself on correct carnival tickets. You need to get educated. <laughs> I think starting from now, you have to say that at the start of the day, Jesse. Yeah, I think you yeah. have to say right at the start of the day when I right after I send like it. right before I get my second nomination. I'd like to go to the carnival. <laughs> <laughs> How much time in a day? Seven, Seven minutes. minutes. 
Ten minutes, had about okay. a minute, so you probably should focus back on the game. <laughs> I like the 10 minutes per nomination system. <laughs> no, no yes, bad Lucas. Great. Bad Lucas. That was great. Even though tomorrow is Sunday, let's not. <laughs> let's you not would say it till after midnight. <laughs> yeah, what? We, we got a movie to watch. So. What, okay. what, what do we reckon? We're like four on each bad team and then a lot more villagers? Uh, 20, with 20 people, right? No, I think we have five wolves. Yeah, uh, yeah, one for four. Yeah, it was usually one out of four. Well, don't you think the wolves are like, don't you think there'd be more carnival workers than wolves potentially? Probably. I would, I would say six, maybe five, five or six. No, no. I would say five because in the, in the summer carnival, it was 19 players and there were five. So unless, one more person would add, just one more person would add a sixth carnival worker, then I would just say five. I also think it's five, five, ten, or five, six, yeah. nine, maybe, depending on the roles. You know, if if, if Adam rolled, I think more roles oh. that carnival roles that can kill, then I imagine he would only pick five. It's five, five, nine, isn't it? Oh, oh, 10. 10. No, there's 20 now. 10, oh, 20, 20, 20. 20. Matthias made it. Matthias made it. Forgot. Also, I know people won't like it, but I'm not going to vote out anyone on day one because it's a long rule explanation. I like the carnival so much. I don't care about a Sasquatch or a Starving Wolf. Two minutes not vote anything. You should nominate someone, Lucas. Mm -hmm. They might have a knife. So. Well, won't <laughs> someone have <laughs> to anyway? Okay, but the other Well, that's not a guaranteed if role. We have a sheep the sheep dog game. Right. We're going to potentially kill someone anyways well then to, we should put a verified that... villager for day one and if they time, can take the shot that no one else is willing to take that's true i just want to see lucas stab <laughs> i nominate joseph <laughs> let's wow. do it a nomination for joseph is there a second we don't only the nominate do we? the person nominating dies right yeah one of them okay. I, I that's, that's brave lucas <laughs> <laughs> and it is. It's not an automatic thing. It's a one-time use. They get to choose when to use it, so it's not oh, an automatic thing. Just and do it. Lucy uh, seconded. Okay. I will mute everybody. This is our first nomination of the day. Lucas nominated. Lucy seconded, and Joseph, you are up. I will say in my games, you are not allowed to nominate or second yourself. So Joseph, you can unmute and give your defense. Okay. So to start off, I'm on the village team. You shouldn't kill me. I'm not going to use my knife because I think it's boring for Lucas. He's been, I was just joking with you. I don't want to kill you right away. I'll kill you tomorrow if you nominate me tomorrow, Lucas. So, so yeah, don't kill me. Let's uh, keep playing. All right, this is our first vote of the day. You still have a minute and a half remaining. Thumbs up to save Joseph. Thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, I see a second down, a third down, and everybody else up. So that is not enough. Lucas voting down? I should, Why did you I lie, should have, Lucas? I should have killed you. And, wait, just <laughs> a second. He threatened to kill okay. me tomorrow. Wait, just a second, just a second. Courtney, I think, is frozen. Yeah, she's uh, yeah. frozen. Because yeah. I thought it was her thumb she's up, but now I realize up. that's not a thumb up. So. <laughs> that's a pinky. Up. Oh, she's gone. Yes, yeah, she, uh, I'm pretty sure she was gone. Recount of the so yeah, I don't think it, time we're is getting not really moving, bad. So. I'm sorry. I know I'm in the carnival, but we're getting really bad storms. Like it's pouring rain here. I'm sure in Orlando, she might be getting it. Oh, okay. where they were supposed to be really? getting what we had earlier. So really, it's raining. I don't hear rain yet. Okay. Never mind. I hear Aren't rain. You in a closet. So, sorry, Joseph. No, I'm down. outside or not outside. I'm in <laughs> my room. This is the 21st century, right? Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Jesse, yeah, did you disappear pool. or are you still here? Oh, he's he's going to check the weather. <laughs> <laughs> well, me and Anna live in the same area, so. So do we want to let time run out to the check? The clock is not moving. It's yeah, it's for, for I'm okay. just going to give a couple minutes to see if Courtney gets okay. back. Otherwise, yeah, we, we have, can move we have a, along. A Sasquatch, right? We could have one, yeah. We could have one. I still don't no. want to kill anyone. It, just, it's... Um, I don't like it. Like that plan. I don't think we have one. I'm fine with going to that. 
I'm mean, okay it doesn't with going change to sleep. Lot. Sorry, Cherry. <laughs> and what? No, because I'm. Um, I have. I don't have a loud voice, so I thought you maybe you might have had trouble hey, hearing me. Oh no, it, it was only when the mic was down, but I can hear you perfectly now. Okay. All right. Did you yeah. say we don't have a Sasquatch? No, no, I said we could have one. But yeah. I, I, I still won't kill anyone, even if we have one. What about I mean, you? Yourself? If you have a wolf, it does make a difference whether you have one person dying during the day or one more person dying during the night. Yeah. Because well, we don't if have the one person is a carnival we worker. Can also, or... We can also find out if we have the No, no, in terms of they would having to survived the worst explanation. Yeah. Some right. will, you know, I, early anyway. I think we get more information by not killing than killing. I will yeah, say one cause... other thing real quick. If a player has some sort of activating ability that would either affect someone who is not in the village or like, let's say for instance, there is a pet wolf and they chose their owner and the owner is in the carnival and the pet wolf is killed that day. If the owner is in the carnival, the owner would not die. Or let's say if the Sasquatch oh. is in the carnival, they would not turn because they are not actively oh, in the village nice. when the village is not to go. Or sheep dog or anything like that. So if you have Thanks. like some sort of activating ability mm -hmm. but you're not in the carnival, it won't activate. And there is a question back. For me. Let's make and sure Jeremy also has a go. Well, I just so even if we we don't want to kill anybody today, is it still worth Nominating, nominating yes and uh second person. people's accusations yes just the second reading. person but not a third person because if we vote up then the sheep i mean i don't know if you don't want the sheepdog to act at all we could just Wait. vote up on three people just a second uh, Courtney, Bobby, are you good you're muted it looks like you're on a phone now are you good do you need the rolls again or anything no i'm good the internet went out because of a crazy storm so yeah, i'm gonna try this on this. my phone Thanks. okay all right <laughs> Crazy so storm is probably a carnival. Jeremy, I would say if you uh, for accusations, and if you remember, uh, you got, you should do that before because you don't when you do a nomination, you don't get an accusation yeah. with this. Also, you, so you want to do it before you nominate. Yeah. You want to do before you nominate. In the game, who like profit from lots of nominations. So I don't think we should oh, like nominate, especially if you don't plan to kill anyone on the day one. That's true. That's true. Let's have the daredevil or what was the other one? A knife throw, I think. So yeah, yeah the throw. thing though, know, if you really don't want the sheepdog to kill, you could nominate three people though. But well, then yeah. I guess you do have run risks right. with the carnival team. Whatever. <laughs> well, the sheepdog There's... doesn't know. Who else is on their team so they could kill one of their teammates anyway, right? Of course. That's They're going to only yeah. be basing this. I'm assuming the sheepdog seven. has to act. It's not They're an option. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, the so, sheepdog will act. I'll so nominate they... Brandon then. I hear a nomination for Brandon. I see a second. So Jeremy has nominated Brandon. I saw Lucas. I think someone else said it, but Lucas Jesse too, is the yes. first one I noticed. Jesse said it. If Jesse oh. said it, I'll count Jesse as the second. I don't know. And <laughs> Brandon is our second nomination. I will mute you all. Brandon, you can unmute and give your defense. Uh, Jesse and Jeremy have nothing to worry about. I am not a carnival worker. I don't activate something from the nomination in second. Um, I am also not a werewolf, so please don't kill me. Um, I do not have anything further to add at this point. Okay, this is our second vote of the day. You have 36 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to save Brandon, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, I see two down, I see three down. That is not enough. Everybody else is up. And your day continues. One more nomination, 36 seconds to go. Do you want us to nominate someone else, Jeremy? So I, Brandon's one of the few people I play with. So I just kind of mm -hmm. wanted to get a little bit of a read yeah. since yeah. it seemed unlikely we were going to kill. Um, I, I think I subscribe to the theory of nominating and not killing if we don't want to. 15 seconds. Anybody. But I'll nominate Jerry. 
There's a nomination Why? for Jerry. Why did we and I see Lucas seconding. I'm suspicious of Luke. This is our third and <laughs> final nomination of the day. I will mute everybody. Jerry, you can unmute and give your defense. I know why Jesse's nominated me. He just wants to try and get a read on me just to see where I'm in this game. I'm good this game. I'm not carnival. I'm not werewolf. I'm on the village team. So it's very early to be <laughs> trying to gauge who anybody is. The only thing I'm going to say is Balage and PJ have been voting down very aggressively. So maybe keep an eye on those, see why they're doing that way. But other than that, there's no real information at the moment. There's nothing to suggest who's on who yet. I think let's see if there is a Sasquatch slash Starvemorph. We're only going to know that if you keep me alive, so please do. All right, third and final nomination. And we might be immediately going to sleep. Thumbs up to save Jerry. Thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down and two down. That is it. So... There are not enough votes to kill. There were three nominations, so time did not run out. So if there's a sheepdog, they do not activate. If you are a Sasquatch and you are currently in the village, you are now a werewolf. You will begin waking up with the werewolves. Can my three people from the carnival please return? And we will go, wait, Courtney, are you trying to get on your computer now? I'm just giving her a second. Sorry, on the app, I can only see one person at a time and that's no good. Okay, are you good now? All right, let me move you back to your spot and everybody is back. So everybody can go to sleep. All right, let's do this. This will change from night to night, but tonight we will have the village shapeshifter wake up first. Village shapeshifter, give me a number between one and 20. Thank you. Can my werewolf shapeshifter please wake up? And give me a number between one and 20. Thank you. Can my carnival shapeshifter please wake up? Give me a number between one and 20. Thank you.
Can my showman please wake up? Like most people, you cannot write down the same names back to back nights. Thank you. Can I have Dazzling Darla please wake up? Thank you. Can I have Myron, the mind blowing, please wake up. Thank you. Can I have the phenomenal Praveen, please wake up? Thank you. Can I have my seer please wake up? Thank you. Can my trapper please wake up if you haven't set your trap yet? or you're not required to. Okay, thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up? All right, I think we have an agreement. Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Active wolf, if you have an action. Thank you. Can my Huntress please wake up? Huntress, would you like to use your one-time kill? Thank you. Can my Bodyguard, please wake up. Who would you like to protect? Thank you. 
and everybody can wake up. So last night there was death in the village and Brandon was killed. Brandon was on the werewolf team. And today it will be going to the carnival, Sonia and Jeff and Courtney and Chris R and Jesse. So have fun at the carnival today. We will see you back tonight. And as always, I will say at one time, I don't think I remind people yesterday, but always make sure you check your uh, chat and everybody can begin. Uh, Adam, I don't remember. Can the, sh the showman can send themselves out, right? They are allowed to send themselves can out. The, right? Can they send the same, same person out back to back? No. Nope. No. They can't write down the same person. Yeah. Obviously, if things get oh, yeah, twisted, it switch. could, but yeah. they cannot yeah. write down the same person back to back. So, knife thrower on Brenton? What was that? Uh, it's a carnival roll. You select someone at night, and if the player survives the vote, you can choose to kill that person in the uh, night. What's the chance, though? <laughs> I mean, Brandon is one of the people who usually is one of the first nominees. You think that he was killed by the night thrower? There's also a huntress. Can they There's kill? A Could be a huntress. A trap. Or a beta wolf, because Adam was saying the thing about sending people messages. Oh. oh, yeah. But I don't oh, know if that makes be. sense yet because I don't think Brandon was, or I don't know, maybe to any of you, but to me, he was not suspicious. Honestly, I did not like any of the three defenses we had last day. Uh, but Brandon's was the worst, in my opinion. So, nominate yeah, Jerry. Uh, Jesse, Jesse Lucas. Why did you nominate Jerry when I thought the plan was for us to just wait it out? I think Jesse wanted to get the read on Jerry. Hmm. That is fairly standard that people tend to nominate Jerry, which yeah. feels a bit unfair of Jerry to be fair. Yeah, but <laughs> I mean, the point was to see if we had a. But there was, there was quite a few like, that didn't want to do that, what I could hear. Yeah, mm. like to be able to let the role go, like the. Sheep dog, yeah. Yeah, mm. yeah, that one. I, I would think not. the thing is that the sheepdog has to kill someone. So if they don't have a good read, that can yeah. also go sideways. So I yeah, that's why I was opposed to it. But I I understand. Yeah. And I agreed you... with Jeremy. That's why I seconded the third number. Has anybody got any gifts or anybody got any sandwiches? <laughs> Probably too early for the friendly neighbor to poke. Someone. No, but the vendor. If there's a vendor, they could have given stuff out. What's mm. the vendor? That's a it, oh, it's a kind of a. But, they yeah, also could have given it to someone who is in the. Yeah, they wouldn't right say it. But Brandon could also be killed by a shapeshifter. They got an option to kill. <laughs> yeah, maybe someone picked oh. the huntress. Or he is the shape, the wolf shapeshifter. Yeah. Oh yeah, he might have died that sure. way. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, might have. Oh, he poor Brandon, death. if that's the case. If he gets <laughs> oh, three out of yeah. There's too many ways, so there's you can't really speculate. Yeah. yeah. But, uh, one question: the trap, if is that? Permanent or for a round? Or? Yeah, it's but permanent. permanent. Oh, it okay. could have been a trap as well. Oh, I'll explain that real quick. So the trap, if you set it on there, it's on that person for the entire game, but it'll only act once. So like, let's say the trapper puts a trap around me. If the werewolves attack me, a werewolf will die. But then the next time they attack me, I would die. Or if a huntress attacks me, the huntress would die or whomever. But it. It's there for me permanently. It's just once it's used, it is over. Emmy, you got questions? Uh, so if Brandon's on the werewolf team, and he but he was the only death. So oh, uh, werewolf. Oh, trap. roller coaster operator. Yeah. I mean, can you put the trap on yourself, Adam? 
No, you have no. to put it on a different player. So Adam, maybe oh, an so obvious the, question, but maybe the Barker too, right? Oh yeah, the Barker. Uh, so Adam, if someone distracted. if someone uh, turns by the Beta Wolf, they they lose whatever power they had before that, right? Yep. Yes. Yeah. If you are cursed and have a roll, or if you were turned by the beta wolf, you would just become a plain werewolf with no original powers. Wait, are they and cursed? Brennan oh, they're up. cursed as well. I didn't realize. Yeah. Potentially. Brennan could have been the beta wolf and then picked himself since he got nominated. That's true. Awesome. Oh, so many possibilities. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we gain anything in speculative. So, yes. so who were the down on Brandon yesterday? Um, Balaz, Andreas, and PJ. Okay. Balaz, yeah, Balaz voted. Balaz voted down on all three votes yesterday. Huh? I want to know why. <laughs> He's aggressive. Uh, Lucas, you nominated one person and seconded two person people. So who's aggressive? <laughs> no, no, I just want to be aggressive. The, the village to go. Three on. nominations, yeah, you were involved in all three. Yeah, but that, that's, that's Lucas's normal uh, as does uh, Modus Operandi. So. You have three yeah. minutes for me. That's why you never trust Lucas. <laughs> I think we should kill today. I don't think we should have yeah. another day off. Do you I mean, we're doing good. We still, we're yeah, are you volunteering now. to die, Joseph? No, yeah. not at all. We always have uh, Barbie. Whoever I, I'm not going to nominate Joseph oh. because if he really has a, a knife, some what what's yeah. the knife? A pocket knife. He would use it now, definitely. Mm -hmm. I mean, if, and if then we, we want to die. If we decide on someone to to get out of the village and let the time run out and see whether we have the sheep dog person, then we have the person out we want out plus have a confirmed villager. That's the dog. That's true. That's an idea. But if we don't have the sheepdog, then we have another day without killing. So honestly, in this situation, shouldn't the sheepdog come out, and then yeah. we can uh, decide so just... based on whether or not they come out, so that we don't take yeah. a blind guess and oh, the sheepdog might not be, and then we waste another day enough, without. Don't they just someone. kill the sheepdog then? Yeah, I don't really think people. Oh, the sheepdog. The sheepdog's yeah. good. The sheepdog but would come out. Yeah. Like, That's... But why would That's... why would you want someone to come out with their bull? Right. Like, but I'm the sheepdog will be out there anyway. Like, no, I'm saying it because just, then sorry, we can Charmy come to a decision to also together. Nominate people. Could you please just wait a second because Charmy was raising his hand. That's okay. I, if if we wait till the end of the time runs out and there is a sheepdog and they get a kill, we can kind of discuss in general who they want to kill. And if there is no sheepdog and we go to bed without killing, I think it's okay since a we, we gain no information. Yeah. We gain no information. We don't nominate people or do something. I nominate PJ. Okay. Wait, I can't second PJ. myself. Is this is disappointing. We don't, we don't have to. Make them we defend them. Thank second. you, Anna. I'll this... second him, Adam. Thank right. you. Lucas nominates PJ. Anna seconds. This is our first nomination of the day. PJ, you can unmute and give your defense. Um, I'm on the village team. I can't exactly prove myself yet that I'm on the village team, but there's a possibility in the future that I can. So I will say that I'm not a plain villager. I do have a role, but I won't reveal my role. Um, yeah, that's about it so far. I'm slightly su suspicious of Yosef, um, but that's my only suspicion. So that's where I'm at. All right, this is our first nomination of the day. You have a minute and 18 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to say PJ, thumbs down to kill. Let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, okay. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, two down, three down, four down. I see five down, five down is not enough. PJ is safe. And oh, PJ, I this, forgot. This no I'm also suspicious of Chris, but. P mm -hmm. PJ, there's Thanks. no village role that you can confirm yourself later with, unless you're the sheepdog, I guess. Uh, we don't know that. We Isn't do, because kills... we have a list of the rules. <laughs> one minute left. So, so... Isn't the one who kills the person who um, nominates them a villager? No, it's an item. No, yeah. But I think yeah. PD is lying, about... because there's no role like that. Uh, uh, no, there, would, there could be a role. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. that, 
exit so to it. I'd like to hear Jeremy talk. I mean, I've heard Jeremy talk about his suspicions, but we haven't heard him talk about who he better. is. And... Lu Lucas, what role is that? I don't get it. Uh, it could be Chepa. It could be friendly neighbor. But he can't prove himself. 30 seconds. He said he could prove himself. Friendly neighbor, friendly neighbor, friendly neighbor, friendly neighbor can prove it. Yeah, already. but then they should already have done what, that. What time was it? I'll nominate Joseph. Joseph. Lessons. Yeah, I second. What did Wait. he say? So was that Victoria? Joseph. Victoria I'll second. Joseph. And I hear a second. From... I... Matthias, did you second that first? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I thought I heard you say you seconded. All right. Yeah, I didn't just so hear it. Second it. nomination of the day, 22 seconds remaining. Joseph, you can unmute and give your defense. Yeah, I think I should come out with my role then because it's so little time left that you might kill me. But I think PJ is lying. I'll stop by saying that because I don't, if he's the friendly neighbor, he could already have sent the. Uh, a sandwich to someone and get confirmed already. He said he can be confirmed later. That doesn't make any sense. If he's a trapper, there's no way to confirm that he is the trapper, even if the trap springs. Because I have the other role. I have the role that I think he was alluding to, which means he's probably lying. Uh, so I'm the bodyguard. And if you paid attention last night, the bodyguard was called last. That's because I'm the overpowered bodyguard. So I get to see whoever gets killed. So they wanted to kill Barbie or Brandon, but I chose to say Barbie, which was a good, I know, I didn't know that Brandon was a werewolf, but I think that's either the beta, my worry is, that's why I asked Adam a question about the beta wolf, is that my worry is that the beta wolf, because I get my information, I asked Adam, I get my information after everything is decided, like the roller coaster, the beta wolf, so that means the beta wolf could already have turned someone. Like if Brandon was the beta wolf, he could have killed himself to turn someone. And that's why he was supposed to die. Or it could be the Huntress. It could be a bunch of different things. But yeah, I'm a, I'm a little bit worried about the beta wolf. So if you think you trusted someone on day one, remember that later, that they could have been turned. Uh, I'm not going to die tonight, obviously, because even if they pick me, I'll just say myself. But uh, yeah, that's it. So don't kill your bodyguard. All right, this is your second vote of the day and there is still <clears throat> 22 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to save Joseph, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one vote down, that is not enough and your day continues. There's 20 Lucy. seconds left. <laughs> nominate someone. 15 please. seconds. I nominate Lucy. <laughs> I nominate Lucy. Nomination for Lucy. Is there a second? Everyone sure, else trusted sure. me, obviously, except for Lucy. So, well, but not everyone who doesn't trust you is evil. People. No, no, no. But I, yeah. like, we have to have counting down the nomination. Out. I can second if I'm allowed to again. Oh, okay. There is a second, and <clears throat> this is our third and final nomination of the day. Lucy, you can unmute and give your defense. I actually do trust you, Joseph. I just don't want to die. <laughs> what? Um, that is my defense. Uh, so, yeah. But uh, I'm I'm on the village team, so you shouldn't kill me. I voted down on you, Joseph, um, in hopes that the wolves won't kill me. All right, this is our third and final vote of the day. Thumbs up to save Lucy, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, two down, three down, four down, five down, six down, seven down, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven up. There's five people out of 19, so yep. Yeah. So it is a tie. That means Lucy survives. If right now one of you people in the village is a Sasquatch, then you will be a werewolf. Everyone in the carnival can return. And just one second.
All right, and I will mute everybody, and everybody can go to sleep. Another day without a village kill. We'll see how that goes. Let's start with the shapeshifter wolf. Please wake up. Shapeshifter wolf, give me a number between one and 20. Thank you. Can my carnival wolf please wake or carnival wolf, carnival shapeshifter please wake up? Pick a number between one and 20. Thank you. Can my village shapeshifter please wake up? Pick a number between one and 20. Thank you. Can my showman please wake up? Thank you. Can Dazzling Darla please wake up? Thank you. Can Myron the Mind Blowing please wake up? Thank you. Can Phenomenal Praveen please wake up? Thank you. Can my uh, 
can my seer please wake up? Seer, who would you like to check? Thank you. Can my trapper please wake up? If you have not set a trap yet, you can now. Thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up? Werewolves, who would you like to try to kill tonight? Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Thank you. Can my huntress please wake up? Thank you. Can my friendly neighbor please wake up? Thank you. Can my bodyguard please wake up? Thank you. And <clears throat> excuse me, I can talk. Everybody can wake up. And unfortunately, we do have some deaths in the night. First, we have Anna dying. Anna was on the carnival team. We also have Barbie dying. Barbie was on the village team. Also, Lucas has died. Lucas was on the village team. And That means that we have going to the carnival today. We have Flick. We have Cody. We have Jerry. We have Andreas. And that is it. I'll use my ticket and go with them. Okay. And Matthias is going as well. Was okay. he just there? No. So the first night. So yeah. Jesse, help me out here. Uh, yeah. 
Lucas wasn't on my list. That means he must be the shapeshifter, right, for the village. Yes. Because wait, no. Because Adam told no, me I get to know possible. I get to know everyone who is attacked. If you die by sh period, um, Adam, like, oh, uh, maybe he was no, he was a villager. Yeah, the only the only way Lucas could have died as a villager, and I didn't get told about it, so I could save him, must have been that. He oh, maybe maybe he seer checked. He could have been the seer. He could oh, have seer yeah. checked the wolf. He could have, yeah. I think. I think we should. Wait, what? I trust PJ, and that's all I'm gonna say. And I want to move away did, did you from get, PJ. Did you get a sandwich from PJ? You're saying? No, but I want to move away from PJ. I want to move to other people in the village. I think I know what PJ is alluding to, and I want to. Okay. Let's go away from okay, it Jeremy if we don't is, mind. Jeremy. Was either of Lucas's neighbors on your list? Because he could be hapless. Villager, right? Uh, I don't remember now because people moved out to the carnival. Who was next to Lucas? I don't know. Uh, Lucas well, was yeah. between Lucy and Flick. I, yeah, they were not. I can show you. So, so Jesse, you were targeted. Oh. And Anna and Barbie, and I chose to save Jesse. Thank you. <laughs> I think Barbie was probably just a plain villager. Maybe because of the hypnotist. Maybe he had a role. Is tonight mm -hmm. then? Mm -hmm. It was day three or something for the hypnotist, right? If they can start. Yeah. yeah. So real quick, I will say that if there is, this is day three. So if there is a drunk in the game, make sure you check your messages as everybody should be checking their messages each day. Mm -hmm. The drunk would have just got villager, right? Or would they have gotten drunk? They initially were given villager if they are in the game. So Chris, are you surprised that Jesse was targeted? Why should I be surprised about that? Oh, you look <laughs> kind of surprised. I'm just trying to figure out how so many people died at night because mm -hmm. I don't have all the roles that are in my head ready. We don't have a stormy wolf, at least, be because, because then... people Because people died, plus somebody was protected, but still three people died, so that's a total of four that yeah. were attacked. So I'm not sure how what that it... happened. And a knife thrower, I think. Put it down on me. I had so many people running down on me, which I can understand, but I would like to know who it was. I did. Um, I don't know who else. I didn't understand your reasoning, Lucy. Like you yeah, said, you it, trust it, me, Sarah. but you voted down on me. I don't understand that. Jeremy? Did I voted down on you, just mostly just because it was the third, third one of the day, and we weren't going to have the sheepdog oh. uh, go either yeah. way, so... I think in listening yesterday, I think the sheepdog should come out. I, I just think it's it makes sense. Like if you're gonna if we're ever gonna activate it, they should say beforehand. Like I because it because like you said, you guys almost let it go and then they didn't what if there wouldn't have been one? I mean it wouldn't really matter because nobody died again. Joseph, in terms of the people or the reasons you didn't get it, one does the um person who switch of people like, would you know? Yeah, Adam told me to? everything like that happens before I get my information. Okay. And then there's like some sacrificial rules. That could be it. And Lucas then... might be the hapless thing. Yeah. Also, I don't know if it's helpful or not for you to tell us who is getting attacked that you protected because you can't protect the same person twice in a row. Right? But the werewolves already know that. So there's no. Not if the werewolves didn't attack. That's them. a good point because it could be carnival or some other role attacking. It could even have been a, like a huntress or something. Like so. Yeah. You know, uh, yeah, it's probably but... maybe be a little more secretive about it. So, I don't know. So Chris, let me ask you: did, Were you surprised? Did you think? Did you think Jesse looked surprised when I lied to him? <laughs> and you what? When I lied to Jesse just a few minutes ago, do you think he looked surprised? I didn't look at Jesse's face at the moment, so I have no idea. I was very surprised because I just didn't think I would be attacked because no, I that was not the right, that was not that was the fake thing I did. Okay, so yeah, were, I mean, I was like, oh, I don't, I feel like I'm suspicious always. So you were not, like, you I'm, were not attacked, Jesse, but I was interested to see how you would react if I told you you were attacked and you were a werewolf. <laughs> so Joseph, what did you say you were? The I'm the overpowered bodyguard, and I'm going to be dead tonight. That's why I'm giving you all the information because this is the true thing. I protected myself this night, so I'm going to be dead not tonight anyway. Not, not for sure. Why would wolf... isn't there a sacrificial person for the bodyguard too? No, it's like oh, it's either one of those bodyguards. It's not every. 
Yeah, we only have one type of bodyguard. Why Can I ask a oh. moderator question? Yeah. Adam, um, is the, yeah. so like with the shapeshifters, you said they go from the same list. Like, are they getting the exact same abilities or are they tailored to like a werewolf or a village? There's, there's a list of 17 roles and right. three opportunities to die. Mm -hmm. It's the same list, so if two people pick the same number, then the second one who picks it won't get to do it because that role is already taken. Right. But it is it is the same roles. Okay. So, so you could it's... have a wolf get a bodyguard or a village okay. yeah, get I see. a crazy wolf action or whatever. Joseph, oh. are you saying there were three people who were attacked and you protected one Which, and then three myself. people still died? Yeah, because Lucas died or something be... else. It, it could be the shapeshifter picking the one that kills you. It could be the whole pet thing where, like... Uh, or the pet yeah. thing. That could have been the thing. If someone... Also, the seer, unfortunately, could have picked mean... that werewolf. It wouldn't count as an attack, I don't think. Yeah. That kamikaze werewolf. So I'm going to nominate Chris. I'm 90% sure Chris is a werewolf. There's a nomination for a second. Chris. And I hear PJ seconding. Um, just one second. So... Chris, you can. Sorry, I had a message, so I got. Uh, Chris, you can unmute and give your defense. I don't know where this is coming from, but okay. I'm not a wolf. I believe that Jesse thinks that PJ is good. Like, I believe Jesse is sincere about that. He seems sincere, but I personally think PJ is bad. PJ is my highest suspicion. Um, I trust Jesse, I trust Joseph. Backtracking to, to day one, I also trust Jeremy because I don't think he would put up Brandon without any reason, put him into the spotlight. So th those are the people I trust. I distrust PJ. I don't think, I don't have particular thoughts about anybody else at this point. I'm on a village team, please vote up. Wait. Um... Sorry, someone messaged me. Uh, first vote of the day, you still have three minutes and 43 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to save Chris, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight down. That is enough. Chris is dead. And one second, let me answer a question and then I will, I just want to get this out of the way and then I will. Master of suspense. Stuff. I know. Okay, Chris is dead and Chris was on the carnival team. And everyone that was in the carnival can come back. All 250 of you. And everybody can go to sleep. All right. If there is a uh, just a second. There we go. If there was a uh, if there is now a Sandman in the game, and you would like to cancel the rest of night activities, please signal as much. Okay, thank you. Everybody can wake up. Your... Good job, Sandman. I'm guessing the Sandman was drunk. Last night, nobody died. Nobody <laughs> sent to the carnival. And your new day begins. That was a great opportunity, Sandman. Thank you. Oh, damn.
Okay. Um, I, I just want to pop in simply because I want to pick up a point that Anna said, but then I, I, I can go and get out of the carnival. Anna, and I, 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 will, I may get this wrong, so I, I jotted notes and I apologize because I thought Victoria had redirected something and apologies if it's not you. Anna wanted to know more from Jeremy and then we went back towards Joseph and then Anna died. And then I've just been wondering um, and thinking that's interesting. And so I'd like a bit more on that, unless anyone has like other feelings on this. But Anna was that's carnival. Just... Yeah, no, but even if Anna was carnival. Yeah, she's still looking for Carnival wants to get rid of wolves as well, yeah. is what she's saying too. Yeah, like all I'm saying is there's carnival, there's wolves. Carnival people can go after wolves potentially. I just like Anna's usually fairly good on their reads. And so Anna's not here people. now. And so I just want to kind of also, say what I feel like. Are you a conflict? I thought under, maybe you might be on the carnival team. I'm going to be completely no. honest, Nick. I um, have ADHD. So I honestly didn't even know Anna was talking. <laughs> Um, I do not really redirect. I tend to pop in when my ADHD is like, you need to say something right now. <laughs> Maybe, that, that, that's let's okay. just... Like, I, it, just it, it looks almost like that to me. And so I just kind of thought Anna had died and I kind of wanted to pick it up because I felt like maybe that Anna was trying to develop something. Jeremy, do you want to respond? Can, can I just ask, uh, I, <laughs> think, I think the Sandman should come out. I can protect you tonight. You're a confirmed villager. Courtney was trying to say something. Yeah, no, I just, um, nothing. Knowing Annabelle outside of this as well, um, and also the fact that she usually has um, a thing for Jerry, like going after her and stuff like that. I did notice something that Jerry said that sounded like she was trying to like throw in a little, a little word, like a little carnival thing. Annabelle never said anything about Jerry, didn't even joke about going after Jerry. And that's usually one of the first things that she does. So I'll just throw that out there. Um, we've got we've got away from we've gone away from that. It's uh, we, we don't do that anymore. Okay. That's all better. Well, I still heard what I when you were trying to say something about Lucas and you said something about like razzle dazzle or whatever. It didn't really fit in your sentence or like really make sense. And so that I say a lot of weird things. I do say a lot of weird things sometimes. Limited time. Do I think, Jeremy. I really Sorry, think, but also yes, I also agree with Flick on the Jeremy thing. I really think the sound. I want to pop that in before I get killed or sent somewhere because I'm a plain villager with absolutely nothing else to contribute. I really think the salmon should come out because you only have one time use. I'll nominate Jeremy. <laughs> Does anyone? Hang on, do we not want to use our time to discuss? There's a nomination for Jeremy, is there a second? Yeah. Jeremy can talk now, right. I think, because we're all just talking over each other and Jeremy hasn't gotten a chance to speak yet. That's yeah, my second. thought. <laughs> okay. OK, there is a second. This was I the first, mute. wasn't it? Yeah. Yes. yes, first nomination. Jeremy, you can unmute and Give your defense. Jesse nominated I a seconded. Go ahead, Jeremy. Sorry. Yeah, that's okay. Um, I did actually want to respond earlier because I remember what you were talking about, Flick, when Anna said that. Um, Anna said that I had given a lot of my suspicions, but I hadn't said anything about my role. And I actually hadn't given any suspicions. I was more discussing the theory of the game. Um, I do have some suspicions, and they were kind of on Sonia and they were kind of on Courtney. Um, I'm on, I'm also just a plain villager, so I'm fine to die. Um, it was Victoria that did redirect. I do remember that. Um, but she would have no reason to redirect from me that I know of. So those are my suspicions. I am just a plain villager, so you can kill me if you want to. All right, this is our first nomination of the day. Thumbs up to save Jeremy, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, I see two down, I see three down, four down, four down is not enough. Your day continues with- Yeah, I, do, I just want to vote on behalf of Anna because I feel like that's 14. what Anna would have done. So yeah. And can we have the Sandman coming out? I agree with Joseph. Could you just please come out? Yeah, there's no reason to not come out. There is absolutely okay. I'm oh, the same. Maybe want to die or something. I don't know. No, the but I'll, I can protect the... you tonight. I the thing out. is, if the Sandman gets nominated, they can come out then. It's not, yeah, or like later, Sandman. you know, like I don't. The Sandman only <laughs> acts once, so it's another confirmed villager. So we can the get the Sandman is in the document. Do you do you it's have any book. other information? Does anyone have any other information on werewolves or carnivals? Because yeah. I don't. So How I much time is left? 
Can I you ask have Jeremy three where and a half minutes? Okay, where so, your suspicion for Sonia came from as well, because she hasn't really said a single well, word. Well, that's why my suspicion that's of Sonia comes from. Yeah, that's <laughs> sorry, my Mateus suspicion. has to say something. Yeah, but, okay, sorry. so I'm the sheepdog, just so you know what happened to the time runs out. Okay. That's why I left yesterday. Okay, Mat Mat <laughs> Mateus, who do you, who would you kill if, if that comes to? No clue. Oh, well, you should think uh, about it. You should think about <laughs> it. I, I do, but <laughs> yeah. So... So, so, so you have so much time now to think for about now it. I would yeah, I would probably go with Balash really? because she's doing the most do negative that. stuff. Yeah. I, I will say Balash has voted aggressively down throughout. Right? PJ know. trusts Balash, I trust Balash. Did you trust Balash? Yes, so why did you I, just a second, did someone just nominate? Did I hear someone say they nominate? Yeah, I'm, I nominate Sonia. Jeremy nominates Sonia. Is there a second for Don't that? Nominate. Don't nominate. Don't nominate. Don't. Joseph, we got a second. Joseph, you seconded. Joseph, you seconded. Yes. Okay. Sonia has been nominated by Jeremy. You can unmute. Oops, let me mute everybody first, Sonia. And Sonia, you can unmute and give your defense. So um, I'm a villager. There's nothing that can confirm me right now. Um, I actually almost fell asleep twice <laughs> since, since I got sent out on the carnival. I don't have any night rolls. Um, um, I stayed up really late last night watching ESPN and watching former games. And so, yeah, I don't have much to contribute. I'm just listening to everyone and listening to the paths that everyone is making on everything. And I'm trying to evaluate the people who died and what happened that night. So that's all I got. All right, this is our second nomination of the day. Thumbs up to save Sonia, thumbs down to kill. You still have just under three minutes remaining. Three, two, one, vote. Let's see, one down, two down, three down, four down, five down, six, seven. That means one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight up. That is not enough. Your day continues. I think uh, Wolf and Connie swore that. I don't it think I don't that... think I'm worth the vote out. I think there's other suspicious people. Um, so for those who wanted to vote me down just because I've been quiet, I, I feel like there's other bigger fish. I think it PJ's PJ's it was lying earlier. I think. No, no I'm not. But Jesse, <laughs> PJ get... doesn't PJ doesn't claim roles. He Jesse, doesn't do that. if you it's... get a sandwich from him, you can just say uh, it. There's there's like nothing. Yeah, I got a sandwich either. from PJ. Does that make everyone feel better? No, yeah. Jesse's bad. Not the truth. Jesse's bad as well. Yeah, it is... would not go yeah. this hard. Yeah, I think uh, Jesse is bad because he's covering up for PJ all the whole time. Yeah. And Jesse reacted really funnily when I lied to him about saving him. And he reacted, he reacted when everyone was killed this last night. We'll nominate too. Jeff. I'm sorry he's talking. And now he's trying to get out of the discussion. Jesse's nomination on. for Jeff. This is the third Don't nomination. Don't second it. Second. Don't Christ. second it. Let's kill Jesse instead. Don't second it. Don't second it. Counting down the nomination. Nice to but meet you, Courtney and Jerry. Sorry, where is this nomination coming from? No, okay. he's, he's no, desperately he's trying to read your record. Because he hasn't talked. I'm like, let's... Jesse's trying don't... to redirect read because one. me That's and Sonia talked about it. That's well, really honestly, strange. I don't feel um, strongly that anyone else really. And Jeff is a wild card. He's complete. He's a question mark. So I would rather get of a question mark than someone like me, who I know is good, or PJ, who I'm very confident is good, or Joseph, or... Pete Balage, something like Raise I feel your like. Raise hand if you are as as confident as Jesse in PJ, because that's important. Balage, okay, thank, thank you. I have a couple okay. things to say. One, Lucy's been trying to talk for a while, then Jeremy, and now Balage wants to talk. And also, Sonia and Lucy are the only people who voted up on a carney, which I thought was very interesting. Lucy, <laughs> you have the floor. Well, thank you. I was just gonna ask Adam to mute everyone because you are just talking over each other. And I, I find that to be very rude. Also, Jeremy is raising his hand for his third time. No one noticed, uh, except for Victoria. We have limited the time and the day. We need to one minute left. Yeah, I know, but we don't have to be rude. Can we know? Jeremy, would you like to say something? Yeah, I, when I raise my hand, I'm just letting you know I have something to say. I don't mind if other people keep talking over no, me. I don't. I want to hear but, it. Yeah. So. Um, this might be a good time then to let time run out since Matthias, sure. Matthias has come out and if we want to agree on someone for him to kill because that will at least confirm him. Yeah. I don't know. That's that not bad. Yeah. 30 30 seconds. Seconds. 
For now, I would kill Andreas or Jess. Don't kill me. I'm the Sandman. I would... Is Victoria the only Don't kill me. Matthias, kill Victoria. Kill Jeff or Victoria. Kill Victoria if you... Why? I was because I don't know. I think he's bad. I'm good. I, think... I don't know what Victoria or Jeff I think, are. I think Victoria is bad. <laughs> I don't trust Jess, but I trust <laughs> Yusuf. So this is he... bad. Yeah. I would well, kill... I'll nominate yeah. Jesse. Oh. Oh, see, I that's, a nomination for that's Jesse. bad. Well, you're throwing my name around. I don't want I'm to sorry, like Jeff. I don't want you to die as a person. <laughs> second. Jeff has nominated Jesse, and PJ has second. This is the third and final nomination. Jesse, you can unmute and give your defense. I'm curious why PJ second. I trust him. If I was a werewolf or whatever, I would have been trying to kill PJ. Um, but it's okay, honestly, if people are suspicious of me and it's going to be hard to move off of, it's fine to kill me because I am a plain villager. I have no role. Maybe some other people in this village who I've been yelling their name out have roles or have more important things, but I am a villager. Um, you will be killing a villager. I'll just go through really quick. I trust PJ. I feel like PJ said not to nominate Balage, so I trust Balage. Um, I don't trust Sonia. I trust Joseph. I don't know anything about Victoria, Flick. I think Lucy's on the carnival team. There you go. Andreas, if he's a salmon and no one counterclaims, I believe him. Jerry's been really quiet. I would look there. PJ's good. Jeff hasn't really said anything. And then he nominated me in the last second. So I would look there very heavily. I think Jeremy's good. Cody, I don't know. Courtney, I don't know. Mateus, I believe is a sheep dog. There, there's everybody. And I'm ready to go if you gotta get rid of me. <laughs> All right, third and final nomination of the day. Thumbs up to save Jesse, thumbs down to Phil. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, two down, three down, four down, five, six down. Let me make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine up. Nobody dies. And since everybody is in the village, now, if there's a Sasquatch, you are now a werewolf. And everybody go to sleep. All right, don't need to do the Sandman. So we'll start with our village shapeshifter. Thank you. My shapeshifter wolf. Thank you. My Carnival shapeshifter. Thank you. Showman, please wake up. Thank you. And Dazzling Darla, please wake up. Thank you. And Myron the mind blowing, please wake up. Thank you. Can the 
phenomenal Praveen please wake up? Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? Thank you. Trapper, if you've not set your trap yet. Thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up? Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Thank you. Can my friendly neighbor please wake up? Thank you. Can my bodyguard please wake up? Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night, nobody died. And today, nobody is being sent to the carnival. And your new day begins. I'm just going to say two things and then I'm going to sit back so other people can talk. But I didn't even think I could protect myself, but Adam looked like I could. So then I did this and I could, obviously, because there were two nights because it was not one night with the Sandman. So that counted, obviously. That was cool. So I protect myself. Ah. I, was the, I was the only one targeted. So and we don't have a showman anymore. So obviously we hit the carnival pretty hard. They don't have any. Why did roles. you say that? That's bad. No, but they know already. But they, they, the werewolves already know. So there's just a second. Everybody, go back to sleep. I overlooked a roll. Sorry, I have someone message me. I overlooked a roll. I'm so sorry. So sorry. So sorry. Can my huntress please wake up? Everybody wake up. Oh, I screwed that up. I apologize, but last night there was a kill, as a matter of fact, and Victoria is dead. Victoria was on the werewolf team. Yes, yes. Nice job, Huntress, where we are. I apologize for that. You didn't ask me Complaints now, Adam. Maybe I wanted to save her instead of myself. Now you never gave me the chance. <laughs> <laughs> That's I'm amazing. Guessing. So we got two werewolves in the night and the carny. Yeah, but he's doing well. Two wolves and a carny? In oh, the night. Then we kill the carny in the day as well. So. 
so Jesse said I've been quiet yesterday and I just the reason why I've been quiet is because there's been so many other people talking I've been able to try and talk so what I was going to say was Lucy claims Sandman and then Andres tries to claim Sandman I don't that was a joke it was a joke was it <laughs> Oh. Yeah, Lucy did it. She just joked. Yeah. No one, no one did it. So I'm yeah. like, okay, I'm okay. <laughs> okay. Never mind that. I thought she, I thought she'd been serious. Well, I no. Think, I think if we have a friendly neighbor, um, it's time to say. I guess I don't know. Why not? Uh, People know. But wait, I, I just want to say follow. quickly, we could have the Sandman, the Bodyguard, the Friendly Neighbor, and the Huntress outed. That's four cleared villagers. And the Sheepdog. And the mm. Sheepdog. That's five. Yeah. Well. I thought I said he was cheap. Right. Yeah. The only problem you is some of these it. people could potentially have been beta wolf, potentially. But I don't know if you, someone who's keeping better track than me, like when we werewolves died at night. night. So because nobody died. Apart yeah. From and Victoria was definitely from the Huntress. Yeah. Mm. yeah. The Huntress also have, only has one shot, so it's not like they can do yeah. anything else. So. Yeah. so you, you could also come out and you are a hero because you just killed a werewolf so everyone will love you when you come out <laughs> there's just no reason why not to <laughs> i'm the huntress then <laughs> <laughs> you're not Lucy. Come on. <laughs> i trust you Lucy, but i don't, I, think I, I don't... And, and, and and here's the thing with like the cool thing about not coming out right away, which is like what something Andreas maybe was thinking is like, you can wait and then like maybe a day later, someone thinks the Huntress died at night and then they come out as the Huntress and the real Huntress could be like, no, you're not really the Huntress. And you I know, probably it's a shady them, character. For the rest of us, then we have two people. We don't know who's lying, who's not. I mean, it's fine. I'm okay either way, but it's up to them. Well, yeah. the wolves know they, they are not on their team. So, you know. Well, because the Huntress only gets one kill ever during the game anyway. Yeah. So now that their role's been fulfilled, it makes sense for them to say something so that, you know. Yeah, we don't waste time on them, I but, guess. You no, know, we're right. wasting time discussing this instead of finding werewolves. Sure. I have, and then I, mean, I have to kill someone and there's like killed my target. a few quiet people who haven't said that they're the Huntress. So I feel like we can narrow it down to Flick, Balage, or Sonia. So we can just kind of hope one of them comes out at some point during the day, and then we can just continue and, and try to find some werewolves. I don't see why we need to no, I agree. discuss it. And, anyway. You know, eventually it comes out. I mean, it'll come out eventually. My suspicions are Sonia, Jeff, Courtney, Cody, and maybe, maybe Andreas, but I'm not sure on him. Or no, not Andreas. He no. came out of Sandman. I but would like I would like to say that I'm the huntress, but I don't want to lie. <laughs> <laughs> you could say it. <laughs> so Jesse, do you still think PJ is good? No, uh, yes, but I would hope he might want to share some information if he has information to share. I don't know why point. I'm not dead. I'm very confused. You gotta wait, share if you have information. You gotta okay. share. Yeah, wait, just wait, share wait, it at this wait, point. Wait, PJ, you're dead. Thank you. I'm sorry. What? I screwed what? up and it just totally threw me off. So PJ what? is dead. Well, <laughs> can you tell us his alliance? Okay. Can you, can you tell me like if, he, if he was a PJ was on the village team. Okay. Adam, Adam, can I you want tell, some you, props for protecting you, PJ for Adam, a thousand can you tell years. me if he was, can you tell us if he was attacked? Because I should have that information. No, no, he, uh, no. That's all we get. That's oh, Sonia doesn't want night. more information from the village. No, that's maybe, normal nighttime. No, I, I mean, the role that I can theorize he is is maybe the hapless victim. So maybe one of the neighbors was targeted. But then I should get information. No, he. No, that doesn't make it's sense. I threw my he would, I don't, no, I don't know. It's, I'm looking at the rules to see what might have happened. I, uh, I mean, it's a question Joseph, for Adam. Everything I gave you was, if you are what you are saying. Everything you got was accurate. Except, I, I, except I for the Huntress part, but yeah. Tell you what PJ was the whole time. Okay. He was the shape-shifting villager, which, like, he even when Lucas, you said Lucas might have been the shape-shifting villager, villager, PJ said, that's impossible. He must mm -hmm. have picked that. How did Lucas so, die, then? He might have been this kamikaze wolf seer oh. thing. That's oh, what I'm yeah. thinking. Or the Maybe. or the pet thing. Hapless or the pet thing. Yeah. Or, or like hap three or shapeshifters. Maybe he had four and then yeah, there's oh, one. Yeah, he was on the big team, yeah. And, and, and I just want to remember, like, he did say he team. trusted Balaj. So my guess, maybe he got some kind of C action or something on Balaj. And yeah. 
That's maybe why I said if you trust Balaj, I trust Balaj. Lucy, Lucy's trying to talk again. Maybe Lucas was a had a villager troll and the hypnotist killed him. I don't. That might have been too but, early, but I don't know. No, I no, uh, I I was counting night. I don't so think you have time to speculate. Jeremy. Yes, two minutes remaining. Jesse said you've been protecting PJ the entire. What do you mean? Protect Verbally. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just Verbally, in, the, in the chat. Okay. That's all. I was hey, so saying, let's move on. Chat. That's all. Okay. Not with any ability. It's two minutes and we don't have a single. I'd nominate Jeff. I what? think what he's bad. Why do you people not Jeff think Jeff is second. bad? What, what do you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Counting down the nomination. Jerry, Jerry seconded. Did he yeah. hear? Yeah, Jerry did. Oh, okay. okay. I didn't hear it. Sorry. No, she has to. Don't kill. Jeff, you are nominated. You can unmute and give your defense. So yeah, I've been I've been paying attention to others who have claimed plain villager. I think there's at least a couple, but there's not as many as have claimed it, including myself. And so that's what I've been really paying attention to. Uh, I think Courtney was the first to claim it and I know I'm one. And so I thought, okay, well, there's two. And then Jeremy claimed it. Uh, and uh, that's why I voted down on Jeremy because I thought, well, I don't think there's gonna be much more than two. There's a lot of roles in this game. Then Jesse claimed it. That's why I voted down on Jesse. That's uh, possible Courtney could have, you know, falsely claimed it to begin with. Sonia indicated she didn't, open, she doesn't uh, wake up at night. Um, Lucy has said some things that intimated she might be a plain villager. Um, so there's there's a lot more claims of plain villager, and that's where I would focus your attention, but not on me. This is your first vote of the day, and you have a minute 40 remaining. Thumbs up to save Jeff, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one, two, three, four down. That is not enough. Jesse screams at Jeff being bad, and then he votes up for him. What's up with that? Well, my thought was people didn't seem to be on board with it, and I'm happy to come back and vote down on Jeff. I just thought if you guys want to use more time, that's fine with me. I would. I. I. I'm not 100 percent on Jeff, but I think the plan today would be for time to run out and have Matthias then kill Jeff. That's fine. Yeah, yeah because then Matthias good. confirms himself. Matthias, yeah. 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 And by the way, but Jesse, then... that just uh, that was the other thing I should have said in my defense a, a moment ago is the reason I nominated you at the end is you were mm -hmm. you were maneuvering it for, Matthi for Matthias to kill me and then I wouldn't even have had a defense uh, to give. Now, maybe my but defense was You were never on my I don't want to go out that way. So that's why I did a last second nomination. I'm glad you got to speak. And it doesn't, yes, your you. defense wasn't horrible, but I also yeah. don't really feel much better about you, yeah. to be honest. I, I, like I it's kind it. of... well, we're running out of people. And, right. uh, again, I'm... One minute. Do we have someone to kill? I would like to hear Flick real heard. quick. Flick, what, who do you think we should, who do you think Matthias should kill Flick? Um, I'm still thinking Anna might have been onto something with Jeremy. And I, I didn't like Jeff's defense. So that's where I'm at. I also think Balaz is being very aggressive. I don't know why Jesse thinks Balaz is like clear because of PJ. That doesn't necessarily clear Balaz for me. Um, I agree. So I, I could say you could potentially, if Balaz is in the very end and people don't trust him, but I just, when very people sad. were going to nominate Balaz, PJ was like, don't do it. Like he was very, had a guttural reaction to it, which made me think he got some kind of information about Balaz. Maybe he got a sandwich from Balaz. Mm -hmm. I'd like to nominate Jeremy. Nomination for Jeremy. Is there a second? I see Flick seconding. You have 17 seconds. This is your second nomination of the day. Jeremy, you can uh, unmute and give your defense. Sorry. Um, yeah, similar defenses last time. Um, even if you want me dead, I'd rather have Matthias just kill me at the end of the day. Um, so he can prove himself. Um, Jeff, Sonia, and Courtney are my biggest suspicions right now. Um, maybe Cody next. I have a, I have a, I, I think Blas is good. Um, simply because of one thing he said, I thought maybe he would be good, but I, I don't necessarily want to reveal it right now, but yep, that's it. All right. This is our second vote of the day. There's 17 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to save Jeremy. 
thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. One down, two, two down is not enough. So, or sorry, three down. Sorry, let me. Yep, three down. Sorry, Jerry. You're in a defense. Name is dark, so I couldn't see it at first, but that was and definitely three down. How much time? I you have seventeen, 17 seconds. seconds. Yes. You're in a defense, and you won't say. Flick Sonia or Jeremy, quick. Sonia in my ten seconds. Why not Jeff? <laughs> Sonia is not a good option, too. I think. So, Sonia, my book. I can't say without outing what I think Balaz is. And I don't think that's beneficial. All right. Time has run out in the day. We did not have three nominations or a vote to kill. So, Sheepdog, if you are in the game, who would you like to kill? Yeah, I'll go with Sonia. All right. You choose Sonia. And Sonia is indeed dead. And Sonia was on the carnival team. Everybody go to sleep. All right, let's start with, OK, just a second. Give me a second. Make sure I have everything so I did not screw this one up again. OK. This is why I do four of these a year because I'm terrible at that. Okay, can I start with the shapeshifter wolf? Please wake up. Thank you. Can my carnival shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you. Can my village shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you. Can my showman please wake up? This is how many people you can send out. Thank you. Can Dazzling Darla please wake up? Thank you. Can Myron the Mind Blowing please wake up? Thank you. Can I have the phenomenal Praveen please wake up? Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? Thank you. Can my trapper please wake up if you haven't set your trap yet. All right, thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up?
Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Thank you. Just to pretend like last night didn't happen, can my huntress please wake up? Thank you. Can my friendly neighbor please wake up? Who would you like to give one of those delicious sandwiches to? Clearly I need one because I can't do anything proper. Thank you. And can my bodyguard please wake up? Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night there was a death. Joseph was killed. Joseph was on the werewolf. Oh wait, no. Joseph was on the village team. And nobody is going to the carnival today. Um, I'm also thinking that Jeremy might be on the werewolf team. So I, I agree with I ask a question, Adam. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Does the uh, showman have to act? They can send up to the number that I show them. Okay. So okay. zero would be a number lower than what I show okay. them, so they're not required. I have a question. Does phenomenal Praveen really accomplish the alliteration you're looking for in those uh, in those names? I mean, a PH sound and then the hard P doesn't. I really don't know what you're talking about. Uh, <laughs> shade. I'd be very interested to hear what I still think Jeff is pretty suspicious, but also I think Flick is suspicious because normally when she's on the village team, she normally comes out with very hard confirmation and she hasn't really done that. So I'd like well, to hear both she, she has been she has been pushing for Jeremy. And I do think mm. that Jeremy is bad. Yeah. Um I I can I can explain that one. I don't like the meta around me. I'm kind of sick of it. So I kind of decided that I wasn't really going to be as yeah. aggressive, but I also think Anna generally is quite quite good. So I'm going on Anna's sus on that. And the rest is kind of just like, Jeremy was all like, I have information about Blas, but I'm not going to share it. And I'm like, and also like all the names that Jeremy threw out there in their defense, I noted down because wolves generally mention wolves. And I just don't like it. It, it feels like there's little red flags. And I feel like Anna must have noticed something. And I think Courtney backs me in that Anna usually has Good read. <laughs> regardless, regardless of where we are in regards to carnivals, right? We are not doing well on wolves. Hmm. So, like, right. that's frustrating. So, I think, I yeah. think maybe Jeremy and Jeff, and I know nothing about Cody. So, Cody, do you, what? What are your thoughts? Honestly, I've just been kind of sitting back and listening a whole lot. This has been a very loud village with a lot of uh, competition. Um, uh, you know. I don't have a role. I also have a black hat. So even on death, you won't know what my role is, but I am a villager. Um, so. Suspicions? Suspicions, generally, I, I don't know where to place Jesse right now. He's been up there. Obviously there's a lot of talk around Jeremy. Um, I'm not sure. I haven't heard much from Andreas, but I'm curious what his thoughts are because I know he is a clear uh, villager. He's a Sandman, so I wouldn't mind hearing where his thoughts are. Not, you know, I think Matthias cleared himself, so he's a cleared villager. Balage has been very quiet this game. Flick, you know, she's been hitting at a lot of werewolves, but she could be a, you know, carnival because she hasn't mentioned anyone who she thinks suspects is being a carnival person. So she's up there on that list, um, but I don't think she's on the werewolf team. Uh, question. Jane's also been pretty quiet. Jerry, do yeah. you, um, 
Do you know how many werewolves and carnival people have died? <laughs> yep. So one, two, three carnivals, two wolves. Okay. I, so, I also would like to hear Andreas just because I trust him. Yeah, I, I mean, I was um, agreeing with what Courtney said earlier about Jerry. I um, also got the catch of this Razzle Dazzle and something she said, which made me think like she might be on the carnival team. But I agree with Flick um, that the wolves are more important, um, especially that we have now some cleared villagers. As long as we keep the wolves out, the carnies don't have a big chance to kill. So um, that's the important bit. And there, um, I would go in the direction of um, probably um, Jeremy and Jeff. I do agree with Jeff that there are an awful lot of plain villagers around, including myself, um, who was a plain villager who was just drunk and so became the Sandman. So that confirms my role as well um, before. But yeah, definitely one of those people who claim plain villager, I think. There's Can something just... about it. Can I just go back to why I said what I said about this words? Mm -hmm. I wanted to try and draw out and see if I could get anyone to fall to think I was Carney. And to me, that my head, that's something that probably would be on the list. So I just threw out and just see who picked up on it. But I'm the trapper. That's why I've been sort of sat back trying to take notes on who's voting who. So the person still alive who I put the trap on, I'm not going to say go put it on. So Jeremy, go ahead. Uh, Trapper is what I thought Velas was. Um, I didn't want out his role because Joseph had mentioned that he was dying um, no matter what happened that night. And Velas said, maybe that's not necessarily true. Mm -hmm. So okay. then my, why, why, why was, are you drawing attention back then? It's like you give. I'm going to Jeremy. Jeremy. For Jeremy from Jesse really? in a second. For All right. I will mute everyone. First nomination of the day, Jeremy, you can unmute. Yeah, so that's why I didn't give the, give the information out yesterday. Um, I didn't think a trapper was necessarily worth coming out at that time. Um, I think we've got Matthias as confirmed. We've got Andreas as confirmed. I think Jerry is carnival, um, which leaves a lot of people available. So if there's suspicion on me, I'm perfectly fine with dying. I'm just a plain villager, and I think we have time to hunt for the other ones. All right, this is our first vote of the day. And it seems that uh, last night, Flick had a little bit too much to drink. She's a little bit tipsy, so Flick will not be able to vote today. And thumbs up to save Jeremy, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. I see one down, two down, three down, four down, five down, six down. That leaves one, two, three, four. Wait, keep your hands up. Make sure I have that right. One, two, three, only four up. That is enough. And Jeremy has been killed. And Jeremy was on team werewolf. And everybody can go to sleep. All right, let's start with the carnival shapeshifter. Please wake up. Which number between one and 20? Obviously there's not a whole lot left. Or maybe there are. Thank you. Can my village shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you. Can my shapeshifter wolf please wake up? Thank you. Can my showman please wake up? You will be sending out a list many.
Thank you. Can Dazzling Darla please wake up? Thank you. Can Myron the Mind Blowing please wake up? Thank you. Can the pre nominal praveen please wake up? Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? Thank you. Can my trapper please wake up? If you have not set your trap yet, thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up? Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Thank you. Can my huntress please wake up? Thank you. Can my friendly neighbor please wake up? Thank you. Can my bodyguard please wake up? Thank you. And Everybody can wake up. Last night, nobody died. And your day begins. God damn it, but as I thought, I was hoping that wouldn't be a trapper. Oh, how did no one die? Well, might be a, a bodyguard action from a shapeshifter. Uh Okay. Or a crust was hit. So what about that trapper thing? Uh, Jerry, you're about to say oh. something. Yeah, Jerry. I, okay, so I think I, I, I'm the, I am on the carnival team. I don't. I think I'm the last one standing. Pretty certain, but I have a chance yeah. to kill someone. So there's still a lot of werewolves. I know you're going to kill me at some point. I think I know why there wasn't a kill last night. So if we can just. N nominate someone and I get the chance to kill them that night. Can you? I killed Brandon. Brandon died because of me. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, okay. So, so we nominate so you... someone with salsa and then you get to kill them. Yeah. So basically, okay. I get to, I am... if, they, if they survive the vote, then I get to kill them from them. I'm suspicious of Cody because I don't feel like he said anything new. He was just repeating what the village has said. I, I it's like on blush. I would like to ask Cody or Courtney. Yeah. I'd rather go for Courtney, and you, that's for my you sister. You go for Courtney. I kind of feel like, like about Courtney, but that's it because Courtney backed me on the animal thing, so I could be blinded by that. Yeah, I was one of the first people trying to call out Jerry. I was also on board with going after Jeremy with Flick and like pointing out some of the things with Annabelle and stuff like that. So like, I don't understand where my name is getting thrown out, but like Cody, like you said, just copies like anyone who hasn't spoken recently. Oh, it's, they're suspicious. 
I mean, like, I wouldn't agree with that. I've thrown some pieces here and there, but I really don't have a ton to, to contribute. As a plain villager, I've mostly just sat back and, and you know. So I want to come out with my role. I'm your seer, and I am the Alliance seer. So Joseph and Courtney are on the same team, and Joseph was a villager. And then I checked Courtney with Cody, and I got a thumbs down. Okay. They okay. are not on the same team. That's so Cody is, not a, Cody is not a villager. So Cody, yeah, we're not going to find out, but I guess... Yeah, you're not going to find out what my role is, sorry. but... I trust I nobody, I guess, at this point. <laughs> so, Jerry, if you want to kill someone, um, I think you should go for Cody. You, you should definitely not go for Cody. You should go for Cody or Jeff. That's the only I, sad thing, well, never mind. I'm not going to say that. But we have to nominate. What if, Jerry, you had other, I am not a carnival worker, but what if you had other carnival workers in here? They're probably like, oh, Jerry, why'd you do that? You know, that's, you shouldn't throw in this Because I think, because the amount of carnivals, no, the, car, the amount of carnival people never died. Right. Right. So, so what if you if chose there's two then, carnival workers we can't just I mean, nominate anyone. I will say if, I'm not a wolf. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, you're saying well, that that's a good thing to say now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you have you you will need a stronger defense than that because oh, I have a gun. Oh. If we have a body, well, choose a direction, Balaj, and uh, left or right. Okay. I mean, if we believe that Jerry's on the carnival team, then she could confirm Cody on the carnival team with some words that you could throw out that she could recognize. No, I mean, Cody one. should, no, but if Cody was on the carnival team, Cody should use those words. Yeah, that's what Jerry I mean. He can show oh, Jerry, you can show the words thing. first. How did Balazs get a gun? Maybe from a shapeshifter. No, oh. I think it was, it was the one. If, if he's on the carnival team, should we kill him anyway? Yeah, yeah, yeah but he's going to, he might explode. <laughs> <laughs> and that's going to be Courtney, Matthias, and Balazs probably, because if Jerry's in the carnival, Cody probably wouldn't kill her. So, like, uh, Jeff. Okay. Yes. Do you have a bulletproof vest? I, I, yes, I do. So go ahead and waste your shot. You could be lying. Um, or, you could, or you could keep him alive, Jeff alive, and I'll, can, I'll plug him tonight and you can vote and save him and I'll give him the next night. It's up to you guys because I go first. Jesse, what are you? Villager. Just a plain villager. Uh -huh. Right. Hmm. I'll nominate Cody. Nomination for Cody. Is there a second? Is Why not? I, I'll, I'll, I'll do it to get the ball rolling. Right. Like, right. Ball, look. Potentially. Uh, Everybody is muted. Cody, you can mm -hmm. unmute and give your defense. I feel like I've already said enough. I think you guys still have two valid votes that you guys can carry on with. Um, I'm voting up, but it's up to you. Right, your first vote of the day for Cody. You still have three minutes, 12 seconds. Thumbs up to save Cody, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. One, two, three, four down. One, two, three, four, five up. Not enough, day continues. Yeah, so I vote up so that we can let Jerry act at night because we have two more votes, which potentially means if Jerry could kill Cody at night, we could also get a wolf during the day. And, and, I, not work. and I can, Was and I can. I thought it had that's to be not during not the day. how Jerry's role would work in any case, because either she has to survive a vote, or she has to pick a person during the night, and this person has to Wish. survive a vote. I'm thinking, I'm so thinking. If she didn't pick Cody vote. during the night, this doesn't work. Yeah. And that's what I was uh, trying to ask Jerry all the, a few times now, like, who has he chosen, or is she the one that she has to survive the vote? Otherwise, she's just derailing us. Well, then check rules. Or whatever. I He's lying. Uh, Andres figured out. Why? Yeah. Hmm? What? Andres is lying about her, her role. She might be on the carnival team, but she's not that thing. Yeah. Hmm. I'm just, I'm just confused. So I, I told you guys that Cody is not on the village team. So why are we not killing? Well, him? I thought that if we voted up, Jerry could kill him. But I guess yeah. that's not correct. But if Jerry and Cody are both on the carnival team, what, they wouldn't do that. Then why would they? I thought it was just a word worth this a try. Is very, this is way too risky. This is way too risky, and this I think going the villagers on. should get rid of Cody. I would it's like to use my gun. Yes, do it. All right, Balaj, who would you like to choose? Cody. 
All right, Bellage shoots Cody, and Cody is dead, and Cody was wearing a fancy black hat, so you have no idea what team he was on. <laughs> I'm not sure why that means what it means, but that's what I have written down. I mean, so your day continues. I don't like people didn't die hats. on either side of him, so his whole like, oh well. Uh, but right that thing. could be. It could potentially. Maybe Jerry's a cannibal. Potentially. I wish I was a cannibal. I love it. Can, how does the cannibal work? Does that kill the next people next to you? Or? Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, three three left so right. if <laughs> Jerry is the cannibal, it could be a disaster because what? it would be you and uh, Andreas. So, so no, we... three people on either three side. Three people on each side. I would like. Either side. I, I think we should get rid of Jeff. Then. Well, that will be me okay. and Belos okay. left. Okay, sorry. Lucy is the seer. Can we listen to Lucy for a second? I think I think Give if it. Jerry really is the person who could blow us up, why not go for Jeff? Because if we go for Jerry now and we lose two villagers, this could be a problem. So let's Lucy, I, I'm sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, I'm I, was I, I just before I mean before you nominate me, I am a villager. Uh, and I think we are at the point where we need to be thinking about the win conditions of all three teams. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm not convinced that there's not at least two carnies left. Uh, I'm not convinced that Cody wasn't even a villager. I mean, he was truthful about his hat. So I. But I got a thumbs. I think down. we got to be careful about what we're what we're yeah, doing. Yeah, but Lucy got a thumbs down, so he's not. He's not a villager. Yeah. Right. I thought you no. said he was the same as Courtney. Are we 100 no. that Lucy no, is he, here? Yeah, that not, could be a lie. He's honestly. not on the same team as Courtney. Not on the same. Oh, I'm sorry, I misheard. So. Yeah. Well, whether or not yeah. Lucy is telling the truth doesn't, at this point, it's just kind of like, I, I don't think we were trying to target her, were we? No, but we are running out of time. Jerry or Jeff, I don't care. Yeah, I'd rather kill Jerry, to be honest. If Jerry is the bomb, it would be me and Balash left. Yeah, I'd but I think like the bomb and Carnival, right? Yeah, no seems clue. to be the law. 30 seconds. Jerry's a Carnival, apparently. I'm going to kill Jerry if the time goes out. Sorry. Oh yeah, I, I'm okay with that too. To Adam, can you be the uh, can you be the cannibal and be on an, uh, like the werewolf or the carnival team? Or I thought the cannibal. Just carnival. The cannibal oh, is on the carnival. carnival team. Oh, okay. Sorry, I thought that was like a. Uh, never mind. Go ahead. No, that's a nominating. I think I'm, I'm gonna let Mateus do it. Yeah. Wait, Lucy, did you say you nominate someone? How much time do we have? You have twenty seconds. Okay, I'm nominating Jeff. Nomination for Jeff and a second from Flick. I will mute everybody. Jeff, you can unmute and give your defense. Just counting. Um, I'm on the village team. Uh, as I said from the outset, or at least from the outset that I started speaking, I'm, I'm a plain villager. Um, I didn't trust Jeremy. Jeremy turned out to be a wolf, and I didn't trust him fairly early on. And I'm not the kind of player that goes after my teammates to to throw shade on or to throw, uh, you know, to make me look better. Uh, so I don't know. I um, Flick has been coasting through. I haven't had a lot of suspicions on Flick, uh, but but she has been more subdued than what I would perceive her to be when she's on a good team. So I think she's either a wolf or a carny. I think there's probably still two carny workers left. Uh, Balaj uh, has generally been quiet. Uh, people seem to trust him. People that turned out to be good trusted him. So I don't have a lot on him. So it's Jesse and Flick and Jerry in my mind. I don't know why I'm trusting Lucy, but uh, generally I've, I've been viewing okay about her, or thinking okay about her. So I don't have anything to defend myself uh i just if once i'm gone take a look at flick and jesse i guess all right this is your second nomination of the day there's 20 seconds remaining thumbs up to save jeff thumbs down to kill three two one vote one two three four five six down and three up that is enough jeff is dead Jeff was on the werewolf team and everybody can go to sleep. 
right, let's start with our village shapeshifter. Please wake up. What number would you like? All right, thank you. Can my shapeshifter wolf please wake up? What number would you like? Thank you. And my carnival shapeshifter please wake up. Thank you. Showman, you can send out this many. Thank you. Dazzling Darla, please wake up. Thank you. Myron the mind blowing. Thank you. Phenomenal Praveen, please wake up. Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? Thank you. Trapper. Thank you. Werewolves, please wake up. Werewolves, who would you like to kill? All right, thank you. My active wolf, please wake up. Thank you. Huntress, please wake up. Thank you. Friendly neighbor. Thank you. Bodyguard. Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night, nobody died. And today, no one is going to the carnival. So, are we just looking for colonies now? I think so. My turn. I think it's just Jerry. Did you yeah, get I mean, any information, Lucy, you'd like to share? I just, I, I, I was between you and um, Flick, Jesse, and I checked you and I got a thumbs down. So you are not on the same team as Cody. You just you, said Flick. Uh, no, 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 sorry. I, I, I checked you, Jesse. Me and Cody? I checked, uh, no, I ju only checked you, Jesse. And it said, Oh, it, so it's the person before. Yeah, it has. Oh, okay. I see. It's team. not like a mentalist. It's like the perfectly oh, no, drawn. No, no. Yeah, I'm a villager. Yeah, I'm happy to be tracked tomorrow night. I have no issue with that. I don't know if we'll even. I don't know. Well, I think Jeff was 
like pulling at straws by saying anything about Flick and that like ultimately made me vote down on him because it made no sense. Um, we just remember there are curses in the game as well. There has been a couple of nights where no one, no one has died, and yeah. Lucy. It depends on what night Lucy checks people who are playing villagers or confirmed. True. There is no one I check who's still alive except for Jesse now. Yeah, but uh, someone could, oh, and Courtney. Yeah, I mean Courtney. True. Yeah, but someone someone could have turned well, down as confirmed. Either way, the, if there is a changed werewolf, they're not. Oh, you mean like changed last night mm. potentially? Oh. But right now, they didn't get a kill. I, I'm, I'm I feel more like inclined to believe that it's just, just because Carnival left, and, and maybe you, <laughs> Fairy. <laughs> well, I mean, if it's does that if it's only Carnival, does that mean Jerry's the mad, not bad bummer? You know, not bummer. not. I mean, none of that stuff's guaranteed, so there might not even be a cannonball maybe in the game. Just, maybe we should just kill her. I'm yeah, ready. Yeah. I mean, she has to go eventually. Yeah. yeah that's what I'm saying. And if uh, we don't have if any she's werewolves, a cannonball, it's better she goes when we still have people left afterwards. Right. I yeah. nominate Jerry. Second. Nomination for Jerry in a second. First nomination of the day. Jerry, you can unmute and give your defense. Wow, only three people seconded. I'm disappointed in you. All right. This is our first vote of the day. You still have. Four minutes, 55, thumbs up to save Jerry, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. That is overwhelming. Nothing happens. Everybody go to sleep. Can my shapeshifter wolf please wake up? Thank you. Can my carnival shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you. Can my village shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you. Can my showman please wake up? You can send out that many. Thank you. Can Dazzling Darla please wake up? Thank you. Myron the Mind Blowing. Thank you. Phenomenal, bleh, you know, phenomenal ravine. Can you please wake up? Thank you. Can my seer please wake up? Thank you. Can my trapper please wake up? Thank you. Can my werewolves please wake up? Thank you. Can my active wolf please wake up? Thank you. Huntress. Thank you. Friendly neighbor. Thank you. Bodyguard. Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night, 
Lucy was killed. Told you there was a curse turn, didn't I? And your new day begins. Oh, damn. So, okay. I did target someone last night, someone out of Jesse or Courtney. I know I'm absolutely screwed and I'm going to be dead either way. So I go first. I can take out who I think the werewolf is because basically the only people who aren't confirmed this village are Flick, Jesse, and Courtney. And one of those three I did target. Oh. If you want to kill me and take me out, take the cards out, go for it. If you're talking about as not cursed, because I guess I'm assuming, can I ask a moderator question, Adam? You can. Can only plain villagers be cursed? Not in this game, no. Oh, so no one's clear, really. We mm. all could have potentially been a cursed whatever. I well, I'm, an, I'm a known entity. You know a drunk am. person be a drunk cursed Sandman? <laughs> <laughs> Adam, could that be a potential role? No roles could have had more than one attribute or artifact attached to them. Yeah. So, okay, so well, then I trust Andreas, and I know is it, Jerry is not cursed. <laughs> is it artifact end, so you can't be cursed and have a ticket then, or? That would... You, you can be a cursed bum. Sorry, no one started the game with more than one thing attached to them. Ah, so Matthias can also not be cursed. That's good. I targeted Jesse last night, so I can, you can keep him alive and I can kill him tonight. I'll take him out with me. I or... don't get what role is Jerry then? I, this is, I don't get it in the She's paper. dazzling Darla. Ah, it, dazzling, it's, not, darling. it's not in the paper. <laughs> Whatever that is, because she said razzle dazzle. And that yeah, there's a few that's okay. not in the document. <laughs> right, yeah, that's just like a code name. Yeah. And, and oh. then admit it, how much did you not all pucker up a little bit when I survived that vote and everyone I wrote it down on me? <laughs> unless what happened was uh there's a cursed turn there's a walk unless there's no you... cursed turn and what you're saying maybe you're the the hypnotist and you woke up during the seer so that you could because isn't that how that role works if you wake mm -hmm. up at the same time as them they you die? just why, steal their role why uh, i thought it was a strong cursed turn calling well it's not that i'm deflecting away from the cursed turn i'm trying to figure out what the other options are like what because you obviously i'm you the don't knife thrower die. i'm the knife thrower there, wait, wait hold on. If there's a curse turn, that means there's actually two wolves in this village, not just one. Right? That's the only way that could happen. So my guess would be Balaj is one of them. I don't know who the other might be. Well, you know where I stand and... I don't think Jerry is a werewolf. <laughs> <laughs> Why did Jerry survive then? Stronger, was maybe? Tough. I was tough. Two you lives. Were, oh, tough. So like, yeah, that yeah. was your attribute then? Mm-hmm. Okay. There's also a possibility Jerry could be a werewolf, and she's just been oh, lying Jesse, about that when, when, when do I ever play this well? I don't know. I, I, <laughs> I will say, Jerry, like, this would be a really amazing fight for Jerry. <laughs> oh. I wish oh. I was a bot. I wish I was a I mean, I find, I find it that. so plausible because she got her supposed role completely wrong. In the first time, and now I'm sorry. No, got it. So, how did I get my, suppo my supposed role? I mean, you're, you're wasting time here. I mean, I can kill on the, the, the day before you were like, Oh, yeah, when whoever we like nominate and they survive, you can kill, which is not how the well, world you could works. kill me, but I it's not going to help the village because I didn't was turn. what you were up to. So, and that completely so I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't have a chance to use my power, be I didn't have a chance to use my power because you were all nominated to me and then all voted to kill me. Oh, no, I, yeah, no, but I, you didn't I, pick I, him. Didn't... You have to pick the target. So I you, have to pick can... different people every night. I pick Flick that the, they just you try to kill me. I pick Jesse. No, I don't last believe. Night. Don't believe for a minute you're the knife thrower. But anyway, you're I like killed Brandon. Yeah. I killed Brandon. So, okay, you have kind of changed your role multiple Too times, describing what it is. Which is I just wake like up a at night. I wake up at night. I pick someone. If that person is nominated and survives, I can kill them the next night. Yeah, that wasn't the explanation the other day, but it doesn't but, matter. You are something. We did have someone you know, or not doesn't change what we have to do. Right, well, I, I picked Jesse. So in the village or not. I picked Jeff, Jesse. Someone is wait, hold someone on, is wait. There, someone is turned. Luciana didn't get nominated yesterday, so there has to be a werewolf, though. That's the other mm -hmm. thing. Like there has to be a werewolf as well. 
Like, you can kill me as a conjurer. Maybe Jerry is the me. only werewolf, and she had a tough person or something. Yeah. I don't know. Some I kind think, of shape shift stuff. Hiding behind the role for the Connie. You're gonna kill me and kill us, Connie, or you can, I, you can nominate Jesse and let him survive, and I'll take him out, and he can go after another wolf. It's entirely up to you guys. I am not <laughs> a wolf want. though, so it would I, be bad because the wolves would get two kills. They'd kill. I'd get killed by Jerry if, if she's telling the truth and the wolves would I, kill someone else. So it's a I bad idea. I would have to kill Jerry and let's say there is, there happens to still be a wolf that in the game. Because yeah. you're the cursed werewolf body. Oh my God. Can you stop with that? Honestly, oh, let's finish no, the sentence. The reason I'm coming back to the curse is because cursed. the amount of times that people have forgotten about the curse and it's coated by in the cursed werewolf as one. But what I'm saying is that you're trying to do that so that it just- I want to kill someone. I want, I, want to, I want an opportunity to kill someone. I know you're going to kill me at some point. But there's a wolf in the game and you're not looking for them. So I'm help, offering to help the village. This is my way of helping. Right, but once you're take dead, don't take it. Because you take up the whole day talking about the wolf. Like we Two could minutes. just kill you and then find them. At this point, the wolves are more threat to the village than I am. I nominate Jerry because she's going to kill me and I miss the village. So it's Jerry. not going to help. It's like seven, this scenario that she's seconds. laid out isn't going to help anyways. All right. First nomination of the day. Jerry, you can unmute and give your defense. Do what you will. I've offered my help to the village. If you don't want it, want it, kill me. Okay, first vote of the day, you have a minute 54. Thumbs up to save Jerry, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. That is two up and five down. That's enough. Jerry is dead and Jerry was on team carnival. Everybody go to sleep. Can my carnival shapeshifter please wake up? Thank you, village shapeshifter. Thank you, shapeshifter wolf. Thank you, showman. Thank you, Dazzling Darla. Thank you, Myron the Mind Blowing. Thank you, Phenomenal Praveen. Thank you, can my seer please wake up? Thank you, Trapper. Thank you, Werewolves. Thank you. Active Wolf. Thank you, Huntress. Thank you, friendly neighbor. Thank you, bodyguard. Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night, Andreas was killed and your new day begins. I thought of another potential thing that could have happened at night that might not have been a curse turning. There was a role she could have been the burlesque performer who distracts. Possibly she distracted the wolf and then she didn't. So she found out who the wolf was and there could potentially only be one, but either way, it's, I don't know. I want to know why Balaz voted the way they did. Andre, because you're the only one who voted opposite and that just seemed a bit weird because I felt like we were all kind of united. Yes, that's why I wrote it up. Because you were united. Uh, As a plain villager, I have nothing in my hand. I can only throw the wrench between the gears and then do some chaos around the village. I think it's Courtney. Sorry, why? Okay, but why would you do chaos in the village, though? Because, so, 
my thinking is that who was at the beginning against my chaotic voting and then switched to be with my chaotic voting, they could be a werewolf because at the beginning, if I vote everyone down, that's better for the werewolves. At the end, if I vote everyone down, that's better for the village. So I'm just... I could kind of see, maybe he just wanted to see what kind of conversation would come from it, but I don't know. I, I really, I only trust Mateus. <laughs> yeah, I, I yeah the, Mateus. the same here. So. Mateus, I think he's really clear person. Oh, we could uh, let the day run out and Mateus could decide. <laughs> I, mean, uh, I, I, I think it's, I I think it's Corby. <laughs> I think it's Corby because when I came up with my gun and said that, oh, I have to, I can shoot someone. And Courtney was so fast and so hard on the defending that why, why did my name even came up? Well, the reason why I was confused as to why my name came up is because like I hadn't said anything up to that point other than just like, oh yeah, that doesn't make any logical sense or like, oh, is this role in, in the game? And so, and also that was a werewolf that was pointing my name out if we just go ahead and throw that out there. I don't, I still don't understand why it would be me. I was just kind of against there, the whole uh, Jerry thing because she was wasting time when if we are trying to find a werewolf, her sitting there trying to confuse everybody as to which carnival role she has wasn't going to be helpful to us. I, I agree with that. Yeah. But the main accusation against Cody was that he was just re uh, repeating what the village said and he did, he did nothing. And I was about to kill him. I just wanted to throw someone else's name next to him. I don't know. I'm I'm on the village team. Uh, um, can I ask a question? Sure. If the sheep wolf were to kill a bum, would the day continue? Would they get another kill? Like, how would that work? If a bum is killed, then the village would get an additional vote in that instance, I would give them like a minute to talk about it. And if they, they did not the vote again, the would the sheep wolf get to act a second time? In that scenario, no. Okay. The reason I ask is I am a plain villager with nothing. So I'm wondering if I have a secret attribute one of these four secret attributes. Well, I'm not drunk, obviously, either, so I don't know, but... Secret attributes? Like the ones that they don't know about. Bum, cursed, wolf's bane, drunk. Well, I haven't been changed. I mean, I shouldn't be, but whatever. Where are the secrets? <laughs> I probably shouldn't say such things. Because, <laughs> well... <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, that's an interesting... Thing, the wolf's bane one that can't be killed by werewolves that could be I could also explain one. why people aren't dying die, mm -hmm. but on one of the nights but I, I still I just don't know I don't know who to not trust at this at this point now right it's really yeah. terrible because I don't have anything to make me more or less trusting of anyone really uh, I don't Jesse, know. Jesse, you know my exact role before the very beginning of the game. Oh, the one you asked for. Yeah, I got that one too. Well, Adam is smiling. I am. Yeah, I can <laughs> see right through that hand. <laughs> You smile with your eyes. Uh, okay, well, okay. I was looking out my window. So that's everyone that's dead is screaming face. now, at least. Yeah. I don't know. I'm okay with you picking, Matthias, but it's not me. I'm not. <laughs> uh, I, I, will I could vote down on any of me. the other three. You don't think it could potentially be Flick? Like, I feel like you've been on fire, but if you were cursed. Well, the, this is the thing. You've also just said that theoretically, you know. You well, could the thing is, I could be. Like, curse but i haven't been changed yet so <laughs> but a curse would say that though right right but then again you wouldn't well you, well, you would know if you 
So, because Adam, you were saying someone wouldn't be able to have a role plus an attribute plus a second one, right? Right. So, yeah. So but if you like, had any items or anything, that would help in this situation. That they started the game with, not that they were like given. Yeah, correct. started the game. No yeah, one but started anybody the game could claim anything though at this point. No, That's, I know. I, I would be a little to, unbelievable. Yeah, I was just trying to figure out because I, I mean, we have no idea what any of the carnival rules were if we actually did have a vendor that gave out the ticket. Like if we have, I, you know what I mean? I, like we have no idea. I huh? got the gun mid game. Yeah, that wasn't. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, I just think that was maybe from PJ. Yeah. It's kind of, with a ticket. Yeah, How minute. much time? So then, one minute. Yeah, I'm going to. No we don't have any nominations yet, do we? No, no go for it. I, then I, I will nominate Courtney. There's a nomination for Courtney. Is there a second? Yep, I'm second. Elijah seconds. All right, you have 54 seconds. First nomination, Courtney. You can unmute and give your defense. Okay, so I started the game just a straight up plain villager, uh, and I never got turned or changed into anything. I never gained any items or anything like that. I have just been trying to help out because I know that like that's all I can do in the village. Now that we're down to these four people, I the only thing that's like not making sense is is Balaj's like logic of like let me just vote differently to hope that maybe I get something out of somebody's reaction to it. And then coming after me simply because I was defending myself earlier. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, I would also be maybe okay with letting the clock run out to where like guys could pick somebody because at this point it's kind of like a crapshoot. I don't know who to go after. I had trusted Flick for most of the game, so it would be it would I would hate it if she was cursed and got changed. That's all I have for you. I'm just a plain villager and never switched up. All right, first vote of the day, 54 seconds remaining. Thumbs up to save Courtney, thumbs down to kill. Three, two, one, vote. Two down, three up, day continues. Oh, well, interesting. a good thing to know would be if you shot somebody, and they were a bum, we would know they weren't cursed. So that would be how, hopefully the person you shoot is a bum, that would be great because that would clear them. I don't know. Um, but I, I I don't know, Courtney, I haven't played with in like six months, but she would probably be my third suspect. It'd probably go Balazs, Flick, Courtney, but again, it's, I really don't know. So we had four people saying the same thing. That's helpful. I feel good about Courtney, but then me and Courtney kind of had that thing in the middle of the game. So like for me, I feel like I trust Courtney. I feel like I don't know how to feel about Blas because I did say you were aggressively voting yeah. at the start. I'm, I'm probably, I didn't like that. Yeah. No, I don't like this. I'm yeah, useless. I, I so it, were you saying you thought someone still had a gun? Because didn't. All right. Day is over. Time has run out without the village voting. If we have a sheepdog still in the game, who would you like to kill? Uh, Balash. All right. Balash is dead. Balash was on team village. Everybody go to sleep. <laughs> nice. And let's start with our village shapeshifter. Thank you. Shapeshifter Wolf. Thank you. Carnival Shapeshifter, thank you. Showman, thank you. Dar Dazzling Darla, thank you. Meyer and the Mind Blower, thank you. Or blowing, whatever you called. Phenomenal Praveen, thank you. Seer, thank you. Trapper, thank you. Werewolves, Thank you. Uh, Huntress. Thank you. Friendly neighbor. Oh, yep. Yeah. Friendly neighbor. Thank you. Active werewolf. Can't forget you. Thank you. Bodyguard. Thank you. Everybody can wake up. Last night, Matthias was killed. And for a final three, I will give you a five minute timer. Once five minutes are up, you'll each show a name. If two people have the same 
their name written down twice, they will be killed. If it's a tie, we'll revote. If you want to end the day before five minutes, you can choose to do so, but your five minutes starts now. There's a potential, like again, like a bomb would a bomb would have the same effect though, right? Like like if we voted out a bomb, they In would have the to vote scenario, again. Scenario, no. Oh, okay. bombs, <laughs> and after <clears throat> after I thought about it, the sheepdog isn't technically the village voting. Oh, okay. The bomb only is activated if the village votes. So I realized that what I said was wrong anyway. So <sighs> I'm inclined to think it's flick, but I don't know. It was just a defense Courtney gave, I think. But then on the other hand, Matthias and Balaj both thought it was you, Courtney. I, I don't know. I... Well, he didn't think it was me enough to not kill, like to kill me. He thought, well, right. So. Like, I... Balaj wasn't the trapper, was he? Because he, he should have said that if he was, but I'm guessing that he, he wasn't. Because I, I assumed that like Balaj would be able to use the gun like a hunter type thing and we theoretically oh uh, no could have he used it on cody already yeah yeah earlier right. it was just That's a regular why I was gun asking you right before time went out i was like what are you talking about a gun it was already yeah because the, oh, the sorry think of the gun kind of threw me and then i thought maybe like that was going to be a i meant matthias is i was thinking of matthias's gun as a sheepdog it's not really a gun was... but his ability to kill I don't know. What was your reaction when he picked the lodge and uh, thing? Because you were like smiling so hard trying to, I was, I was looking at you going, oh no, Jesse just found out he won or something. It's funny because I was looking at you and it looked like you were smiling pretty hard and I thought there were two wolves. <laughs> I thought there were two wolves, but now I'm not so sure because I don't think. Well, obviously there aren't two wolves or the game right. would be done. Right. Well, I was just hopeful he was the werewolf. I thought I thought he hit it right. I Blage was my number one out of the th four, the three of us. But three you, of did, you. you didn't come across though as thinking Blage was your number one. It looked like you were a duo, kind of. Yeah. That's uh, like, it honestly that's swapped like six times. I, I, it's hard. I don't I have any. Can't tell if you're overthinking or like deflecting constantly. I don't know what is going on. Probably overthinking. But the thing, the thing is, it doesn't like anything that happened earlier in the game doesn't really matter because. But we're assuming a curse turned. But you literally were all like, Balazs was like, oh, it was a thing at the start of the game. And then you're like, oh, yeah. And then you were like, as if you were in the same. Oh, and yeah. Like, we know, we know, like, we're on the same. I team. was going yeah, based on what PJ said, because PJ seemed to have cleared him. And I believe PJ was the shapeshifting right, but if we're villager. Talking about a curse, you're also, you just said a minute ago, like, anything that happened around the game doesn't really matter, because it's a curse turned. It was in the last, like, couple of days. Right. No, I mean, that's true. That's why I've kind of been swapping around. You, you but I'm worried you, because you guys are both talking a lot to me that sorry. one of you is a werewolf and the other one's going to vote for me. You've just been flipping around an awful lot. And I just, it, it's not. Well, it's because it's, I have no clue. I don't know. I do think it's Flick, though. I do think it's Flick. Now I think it's Flick. Now I am just because you're kind of suspicious of me and i know i'm good unless but like how would i know you're good though you like i know i'm good please, you don't know prove to me that you're good. what no please prove to me that you're good because you've been flipping around i can't i, don't have I can't anything. i i know you only have your word but like i only have my word right but, like, of course and courtney place. only has her word i mean the only things i i mean if you want to go back again i could have switched but i did nominate jeff several times i nominated jeremy after you guys were on him but that was the I, whole word that night where nobody died yeah, i know i know that so my words are really useless i i get it all of our words are yeah. useless like everyone's gonna be trying not to die <laughs> i was like, i mean it's not about trying not to die for me i just don't want to like pick the wrong person i i yeah, like I'm on. I, this is this is why I hit like final threes because like, right? It, there's so much on the village at this point because it could literally it's like a, it's like a, a you know a coin. Thirty pack. seconds. Okay. So it looks like we're just gonna have to put a name down on the screen and see what happens. Right. <laughs> at this point. Or it. Oh, whatever. Okay. Right. Whatever. That's fine. 
I don't know what to. Ten. I mean, also my curiosity about attributes was because I never changed and I never got any messages from Adam. That's, I mean, I don't know if that helps at all, but that's why I was wondering about bums. And all right, five minutes are up. So I need you all to have a name ready. Give me a thumbs up when you're ready to reveal. Is everybody good? All right, three, two, one, reveal. That's two votes for Jesse. Jesse is dead. And the werewolves win. <laughs> wait, 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 before everyone starts talking, before everyone starts talking, let me explain a few things. First off, Flip got turned with Cody and Jer or Cody and Jeff still in the game, and then she kind of got both of them killed that day. And then she didn't wake up that night, so I don't know if she didn't know she had turned or if she was like protesting the fact that she turned, but she did not. So one of the nights there was no kill. It's because Flip didn't wake up after she turned. So the things I messed up, which there were a couple, Lucas should not have died because he was tough. But since he was the huntress, I told him after I realized he shouldn't have died, I said, as long as you don't watch and you don't go into Discord, you can still use your ability at night. So that's why the following night, I forgot to say the huntress because Lucas was out and then he messaged me. You so that's where I screwed up. I apologize to Lucas and Victoria. That was kind of bad for both of you. and. Let me go through everything else that happened. Anna was the carnival shapeshifter. The first night she got to, she got the Easter bunny wolf, which allows her to poison a player. She chose Lucas. I rolled a one. So Lucas was going to die the following night. Um, PJ was, and then after that, or on night two, Anna picked a number that had already been picked. So she didn't get it in action and she died because PJ got a gun the first night, gave it to Balazs as the gunsmith. The next night he was the huntress and he killed Anna. The following time he woke up, he got the death card. Jeremy was the shapeshifter wolf. His first night, he was the second to go and he picked the exact same number that PJ picked, so he didn't get an action. Then he, was, he got a night watch action, which meant he picked a player who would be the second nomination. He picked Andreas, but you killed Chris on the first nomination, so that didn't happen. The third time he woke up, he again picked a number that had already been picked, so he didn't get an action. He got the bartender action, so that's why Flick didn't get a vote, and then he was killed. Your showman was Chris. She also had a pocket knife. She was nominated and could have killed Joseph the bodyguard, but she chose not to. Um, she sent out some people, obviously. Jerry was the knife thrower who was also tough. She did indeed kill Brandon. She picked Brandon on night zero. He was nominated, survived. She killed him that following night. Then she picked Jeff, Andreas, Flip, Courtney, Flip, Jesse. None of them ever got nominated. There was no Myron. There was no Praveen. Andreas was the drunk. At that point, two villagers had died, so he became the Sandman. He used his ability, obviously. Lucy was the Alliance Seer. She checked Barbie the first night, and then Barbie was like, I'm the Lycan, don't bother checking me, but she had already been checked. But she, Lucy found Brandon, but Brandon was already dead. Then she checked Joseph, knew Joseph was good. Courtney, Courtney was good. Cody, Cody was bad. Jesse and Balazs, she checked. She knew both of them were good. Victoria was a curmudgeon werewolf, so when she was sent to the carnival, she didn't actually get to go. Cody was a werewolf with a black hat. Brandon was the pet wolf. He chose Sonia. So when he died on day on night one, Sonia lost her first life. Sonia had two lives. Um, Jeff was the godfather wolf. He used his kill on the second night to kill Barbie. So that's why there was that additional kill. Um, Lucas was the huntress, like I said, and he killed Victoria. 
Joseph was the bodyguard. Everything he told you was the truth. And he did get to protect himself because Andreas ended the night in between. So that's why he was able to protect himself. Sonia was the strong man. Like I said, she lost her first life when Brandon died because she was the pet owner. And then when you voted, she died. Uh, Sheepdog was Matthias with a carnival ticket, which he used. Also, Brandon had a carnival ticket, but he died before he got to use it. Flick was a cursed villager who turned, like I said, the night when Cody and Jeff were still alive, they both picked Flick, turned her, they both died. So then when she woke up, she was by herself. Courtney was a plain villager. Balage was a plain villager that was given a gun. Uh, Barbie was Lycan, and Jesse was a villager with Wolfsbane. So the wolves couldn't have attacked him at night and killed him. And I apologize to Lucas for screwing up your role. I apologize for Victoria for getting you, because I assume that Joseph would have protected you, because I think at that point he was thinking he couldn't protect himself. So you probably would have survived, but I apologize. And I think that covers everything. I had I had all the wolves written down too. Correct. <laughs> it was good for you, yes, obviously. <laughs> <sighs> that was have one again. Flick. It was good it job, was nice. Flick. <laughs> I checked Discord. I checked Discord. I did actually forget about the gun. That isn't like a confused play. I literally forgot that the last had shot Cody. Hmm. I thought Cody was a cannibal. I really thought he was a cannibal. So I was never going to target him. Well, you see, Joseph, that happens when the best player is killed incorrectly on nights too. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, why do you keep, keep killing me incorrectly? What I, have I done? Someone would have killed you anyway, so. Oh. Well, I'm yeah, glad I you came back after a few months just to uh, mess up there in the nah, end. No, no worries. It's, okay. <laughs> it's you play good, Courtney. It's just got me the curse. Yeah. <laughs> but Jesse was so correct. He was saying so many so correct things the whole Jesse game. Did a great job. The whole, him. The whole game was really he was sad. like correct about a lot of stuff. The whole game he was correct oh. about a lot of stuff, but people just wasn't receiving no it for some to reason. Him. It was sad. <laughs> I feel like he felt confused and then that confused me and that made me just not trust him. <laughs> <laughs>